Roku. Just like your smartphone accesses an app store to add new applications, your Roku streaming player or Roku TV accesses the Roku channel store to add new channels. By downloading the Hochanda channel, you'll be able to access your favorite craft channel on your TV anytime you want to watch. Here's how to do it. Turn on your TV and connect your Roku device. Next, turn the power on and press the home button on your Roku remote. Scroll up or down to select settings. Select your network and select setup connection. Roku uses a wireless connection, so select your router name and add your password. This should be on the side or the bottom of your router. If this is the first time using Roku, then you'll need to set up an account on the device or by going to the Roku website. That's it, now it's time to add the Hochanda app. Simply press the home button on the Roku remote. Scroll up or down using the arrows on your remote to select streaming channels. Then open the channel store. At the top of the channel store, you'll find a list of featured, new and popular categories to explore. Enter Hochanda into the search bar and this will take you to the Hochanda app. Now simply select Add Channel. When you see the added channel screen, press OK and return to the home page. Now scroll down to the Hochanda app and press the star button on your remote. You can then use the arrow buttons to move Hochanda to the top of the screen for quick and easy access. And that's it. You can now watch, purchase and catch up with your favorite shows 24 hours a day, seven days a week on your TV whenever you feel crafty. It's that time of day again. It's 7 o'clock in the evening, this cold winter's evening. But don't worry, Yanis is here to keep you warm. Uh, and we've also got yarn balls. We've got those on the show. We've got lots of things, sunset specials and everything. Well, hello. Nice shirt. I was going to say, nice dress. Hey. <laughs> I, will, I will have to tell you what my manager said to me earlier about this dress. We can't be put on air. We okay. He was, you know, he's winding me up. Oh, but anyway, I was I say, like, it's a nice dress. Thank you oh, very much. Nice. Yes, we're matching. You've, uh, mm. I, I did, I did look and see what you were going to be wearing, and thought I'd. Uh, oh, thank you, yeah. thank you. Mm. <laughs> tell me, you had fun, with Matthew Palmer. Matthew Palmer. Ah. Yes, what, we had some fun. <laughs> what a good guy. What's this about ET facts? Oh, right, something to do with. He said that a load of, uh, it's like computer games, yeah. E.T. and um, Pac-Man and uh, other, other video games available yeah. were buried in a desert. Yeah. And I'm like thinking, is he having me on? Right, and I've heard this. Right, yeah. and it was back in, I can't remember, it's like 1983, yeah. thank you, Emily. Yeah. And apparently they have been discovered. Right, so, but they were buried yeah. in a desert, right? Right. Why were they buried in the desert? Right, this is, apparently because they had too much stuff, but then yeah. they were discovered in 2014, but what I want to know is, yeah. why did some random person randomly go and start digging in a desert? No, to find, to find them. They what, heard I, them so it's an urban, urban myth, and then yeah, they, they, they went, oh, okay. they went trying to obviously discover it. And apparently they did, so there we go. Are they worth money now? Um, one of them sold, Emily said, for, thank you, $1,500. Well, it's worth your time right there. Mm. Do you think they still worked? Don't know. Don't know. Yeah, I want to know which desert. Which desert? You might go, we'll, we'll have a okay. look at that. <laughs> Something that's worth your while is having a look at our deal of the day. Mm -hmm. uh, ties in with uh, Matthew's one day special perfect. Yeah, it? absolutely. Mm. Loving these. Uh, so you've got your watercolour colours. Um, is this the potters? Yes, it is. Yeah. So you've got your potter blue, potter pink and potter green. And you can see a nice little swatch there. And you're getting your, I believe it's your number six worker brush. Yeah. So this is your silver line uh, worker brush as well. Yeah. Look, what I would say is the quality of the actual paints because uh, these are pre-blended, mm. so it gives you that natural colour. Yeah. Matthew spent years and years and years honing these colours. Developing, yeah, yeah. Because a lot of the time you'll take, say, a green mm. 
from, uh, say, some paints. You yep. put it on, it's a really stark, harsh, vivid green. It just yeah. doesn't look naturalistic. So what Matthew, and we've just got a little swatch here, what he wanted to do was create that authentic, natural look mm. out of the tube. And he's done it. Yeah, so really good. And have you ever been into uh, an art supply to see how much paint cost? Quite a bit. Yeah, you a lot, yeah. right? <laughs> a lot. So the fact that you think 1341 for all three of those mm. and the brush is exceptional value for money. It is, and he was also saying in the last hour that, um, and he'd hardly used any, he'd done about seven paintings with the, with the, co with the colour already, yeah. and he reckoned that this would probably last him 40 odd paintings. That's wow. what he said. Yeah. And that blue, so perfect for your skies, you've also got the green, mm. uh, and then you've got obviously the browns, well, so you get more earthy tones. I think it's a really good set. Mm. Lou was actually, funnily enough, yeah. we genuinely didn't plan this if you're watching the previous hour, mm. but Lou pulled out her, it was a silver line brush, right. and started using it. And um, we were saying to her, mm. like, we've got this actually as a deal of the day, and when she saw the price, her jaw hit the floor. Oh really? Yeah. yeah. Well, I, like sixteen pounds and thirty-nine pence off. That is a really good deal. Yeah. Lovely. Getting the brush, getting the paints, getting mm. an absolute bargain. Let's jump onto the website as we, we head go. to our first look of our sunset specials. Uh, so you can see there all the goodies on the website. Have a little look. We've also got our seven-day savers as well. Wow! I tell you what, you can get ahead for this hour. Uh, there is a lot going on, uh, something for everybody, all courtesy of our Sunset Specials. Wow. Do you like yeah. neon? I like, I like neon. Yeah. It must be the boy in me. Uh, no, I love neon. Do you like neon too? I do. Yeah, so this is pretty cool. And I love the fact that, look, home decor, dreams, is quite a positive affirmation. Yeah, mm. like that. And you've got green. So you just, shall I open it? We did open it the other day. Let's bring this out. And you just pop a couple of batteries in. I do not believe batteries are included. Uh -huh. No, they're not. We haven't okay. got any in. But it's a fabulous green neon. And it's just got the, like, the little switch on and off. I've got a little uh, question for you. Yeah. Throw this out to everybody, all you movie buffs. Tom Cruise was in a film called Cocktail. Yes. What was the name of the bar that he dreamt of opening? Was it Dream? Close. Dreams? -a? It forms part of it. <laughs> Ream. <laughs> no. Cocktail and Dreams. Oh! Cocktail and dreams. dreams. There we go. Oh. But even with the neon in there. So look, you got dreams. Fourteen ninety eight. Your price. You're saving five pounds. It's brought to you by Heidi Swap. A lot of people going in for this. I think just to decorate a room look mm. fantastic. Yeah, I love it. Maybe we could get some batteries at some point. That be. Oh, we know. must have batteries, otherwise our mics wouldn't be powered. Well, there I'm you sure go. they're AA. Yeah. Oh. Just having a look. It just yeah. slides off. Oh, there. That side. I was looking at the wrong side. Do you want me to? Turn? Yes, please. Thank you. There we go. Yeah, we just going to need two uh, AA batteries. We can do this. Uh, so what I uh, can also read, so tells you the instructions on the back here. Remove plastic cap at the end of the neon wire. Uh, starting with the end, string the neon wire through the back of the shape, through the first hole, and pull all the way through. So really easy. Press wire firmly into the groove and continue weaving in and out through the holes in order to, uh, in, or, in the order shown. So look, it's on the back. It shows you which way to do it. There you go. Uh, you all right, Yannis? Yeah. Good. Done. A tape measure. He doesn't need a tape measure. Right. So. Oh, oh wait a second. The ends just, just come out. <laughs> you just pop that in. <laughs> Talk amongst yourselves. All right. Give me. Give me a second. <laughs> Gadget man. All right, give me a second. <laughs> the, pressure. the pressure. Go on, do All a right, closer. Here we go. Here we go. Done. Okay. Now, if we can get the lights down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, obviously, it's neon. They are. Yeah, they are. But on. you'll they see it on. when you. Yeah. Here yeah. we go. But it's worth it. I love neon. Yay! There you go. And can I just say, it is much brighter uh, in the studio than it is and on it screen. Looks, it yeah. really is much brighter. Oh, in fact, on the. In fact. It looks brighter on the on the on the on the not on the close up, yeah. not on the close up. Yeah, yeah. There we go. There you go. That's really it's nice a, and I bright. Think it's a screen. Yeah, it's a screen. <laughs> it is the screen. Yeah. Ooh, thirty percent of the stock has gone. Wait, come here. I've got I've got an idea. Mm. Uh, so now there is additional shipping. A little bit of a wait, but it's worth it. It's worth it. Okay, three it's, weeks. 
uh, it must be because of obviously Christmas. for Christmas as yeah. well. So, but look, worth it because it's a nice way to see in the new year. Mm -hmm. And then obviously you put it through there. Yeah. Okay. So uh, details on the screen. Fourteen ninety eight. Your price there. Mm -hmm. What else have we got? Now we are memory keepers, which is good. In fact, I think I oh, saw. Do you know you can make it flash? Sorry, I just realised it's oh, all flashing. I did not know this. It's in flashing mode now. Oh, I, want to turn it, I want to turn it off. It's, it's like Christmas lights. There's another mode here too. It's pulsating. Oh wait, if we could, if we could get the lights down again. Can Sorry, we? You have can to see we? This. Go on, go on. Go on, you have to. Um, I was, we, this is for the previous. So we got the different. See, look. And then you can go through. Look. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that's all I wanted to show. Brilliant. It's like a heart monitor. <laughs> <laughs> Our producer's heart rate. Yeah. Uh, what have we got here? Well, we are memory keepers, and I actually saw somebody, it was either on um, a crafting group or it might have been on our Facebook page say that they'd seen that this was coming on and mm -hmm. um, they're really excited about it we are memory keepers You're very popular yeah absolutely yeah. so you kind of do your stitching with it oh so Emily was describing to Is me it like a needle punch type yeah thing? yeah so we can see here on the packaging like you sort of literally punch up and down yeah and you create your stitches this is amazing yeah so threading through, uh, great saving, five pounds saving there, mm -hmm. and you get something. Look, I think it's pretty nifty. It is exactly like a needle punch. So you've got your threader here. Yeah, yeah. That's obviously important. You're getting two of those, mm -hmm. uh, and then, oh. <laughs> and then you've got some oh, stencils. Look, stencils I think. in there as well. Yeah. So this something. is what you would use to punch through. You've got different designs coming in, mm -hmm. and that's what you would use to punch through. It's very hard to see. No, I know, okay. I know. Yeah. I'll leave those in there. Brilliant. So, okay. Full instructions as well. Uh, this one is also an extended delivery. It's going to be three weeks again. Um, look, is it? Apologies. I know it's. I know uh, it's long. It's only because of Christmas. It kind of had to. We had to write off everything like, that uh, comes a week, to a halt. Basically, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Nineteen ninety nine. Your price there. So. To be clear, there is a long extend delivery on both the first two items. Uh, 474 oh, item number. <laughs> okay, and this one. And this one. Well, this will go very well with this. Indeed, that's always nice side by side. So, yeah. if you want some it's extra like someone colours. thought about it. Yeah. Mm. Well. <laughs> mm -hmm. So you've got your four different colours. They're quite nice pastel-y colours. Oh, that's that's metallic. That one, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit yeah. of gold. Give it a little, yeah. Mm -hmm. So nice colours uh, coming through here. Fifteen ninety six. Your price. You have got your grey, your pink, your gold, and your citrine. And your bobbins. And the bobbins too. Yeah. So matching bobbins. As in, I, I didn't mean bobbins. What do I mean by? You mean uh, yeah, your little. It is a bobbin. bobbin. Oh, sorry. Yes. But matching. So you put in the bottom of your machine. So oh, you say, yeah. You know, bot top and bottom stitches match. Got you. I see. You sorry. Oh, <laughs> Following uh, eventually. Six six eight one zero oh, six. Your item number. If you want to get all of those. Hey, now that's. I mean, fifteen ninety six for mm. all four of those. That's pretty good value. It is good value as well. Yeah. And then we've got some with a bit of metallic thread. Oh. I love this. Wait for this. Yeah. So we've got to open this up. Of course we have. Now, first thing that strikes me, Alex, just feel that. Just up with one hand. It's good weight, isn't it? Very good weight, yeah. right? Now, should we open that up? Yes, please. So I don't look. Yay, there we go. Ooh. Oh, but look at it that. Is Catch the light. The gold. Oh, ho, ho. That's, That's lovely, isn't lovely. it? That's lovely. Really, really nice colours there. So you're getting uh, an awful. <laughs> Awful lot, yeah. Uh, in there, really, really nice. No, how many meters is this? Two. Well, it's it's two meters. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nine nine ninety nine for two meters. That's uh, really saving good. Twenty pounds. Yeah. Very, very uh, good. Nice bags, nice cushions, yeah. even curtains. Don't you think? I think just, yeah, home decor, bags, mm -hmm. cushions, curtains, blinds. Uh, you could do a lot with this. Great value for money. Lampshades. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Uh, you could split it in half. Sure. You know if you if you knew you wanted to do a lot, yeah, double up nine ninety nine. You saved yourself forty pounds. So if you do, wow. do it twice, obviously twenty yeah. quid, you saved yourself uh, forty pounds. Indeed, lovely mm. stuff. Thanking you. That's a really good deal. Yeah. Lots of you um, getting on the phone lines for this, or of course shopping online. Um, a reminder, a, blah, 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 a reminder that you're <laughs> yeah. good uh, folding, by the way. Is it really? Yeah. I think I'm rubbish at it. No, Molly's no, much no. better. Oh. Um, a reminder that have I seen Yanis fold? No, I it's haven't. A fair point. Oh, are you worse than I am? Yeah. Put I'll it the other way around. Okay. Just this way. 
And then you do that. Ah. Bit of that going in. Okay. Maybe so. Oh, there Molly. A round of applause for Molly. Thank you. Thank you. You should do the do bow. You, you know, uh, when you, because Alex is a very talented actress, so <laughs> on the <laughs> stage, how did you bow? Oh, we did this with Scott. Did, oh, did, did you? you see no, it? No, I didn't. How did uh, okay, I? Okay, no, no. We were taking, sort of taking the mickey a little oh, bit. Right. But we actually did a certain, you know, a certain very, very theatrical. Yeah. Company, yeah, yeah, we were slightly take no, not the head chander. Um, we were slightly taking the Mickey yeah. about 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 the poncy bows. Yeah. Okay. So, so you haven't, didn't see some. No, Scott I do genuinely this. didn't it see it. Okay. How do you bow? Okay, wait, wait. So, um, wait. No, how do I bow? I yeah. don't know because I don't really like bowing. You, 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 I probably you, you, just like just that. Just do that. Okay. Whatever, just wait. Right. Okay. Okay, but wait. This is. I want to see this now. I have to take my I have to take okay. my shoes off. Okay. So, okay, so normally the, then call the other actor back yeah. on. So we like. Yeah. Oh yeah. Emotionally drained. That's very good, <laughs> No, no, good, no Alex. Scott, yeah. Scott's one was even yeah, better. Scott's emotionally good. drained yeah. one was better. You ready? Well, I want to see this. Okay. Go on. Okay. So. <laughs> like you've just gone through an absolute ordeal. Yeah. <sighs> Oh, and then, yeah. uh, also, thank you. And yeah. it's always to the audience yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. no, yeah, this is the last one. This yeah. is the last one. Go on. Okay. <laughs> Go on. Okay. That's it. It's like Djokovic in the tennis, because he always you. does that to the crowd. Does he? Have you ever seen him? <laughs> no. <laughs> Any tennis fans know what I'm talking about. Lovely. All right. I'm we... just going to put my shoes on. Go, go for it. Ten ninety nine. <laughs> your price. Uh, we've got to move on now. We've got some dyes. <laughs> oh, sorry. This is the, the price of the dice. I apologize. Ten ninety nine. Uh, your price for your dice. Wow. Ten ninety nine for mm. all of those dice. Yeah, it's good. Alex, that's a great price. And you yes, you do. Magnetic sheet. I mean, you think even that's that? That's good it's value. It's a for very money. good value. Look yeah. at that. And you, I love this theme with the, you've got your scissors and your yarn ball yeah. and your um, coat hanger, yeah. your mannequin in there as well. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's good, your, isn't it? What you've got your sewing machine, all of that for ten ninety nine. Saving, very, very good one. Yeah. yeah. On. Sorry, saving no, no. fourteen pounds is what I was gonna say. Yeah. Twenty dies in total. Like oh, it. Oh, good value for money, and that's what we're all about. Good evening, good morning, Ho Chanda. Take advantage. You get maximum value for money. And you always get quality, which uh, Ho Chanda is important. Yes, it does. And now we have some yarn balls. It's all about the yarn mm -hmm. balls. Taking a look here. I love the colours. Yeah, they're beautiful, aren't they? Nice yeah. sort of do you say that's like a kingfisher colour, or is it I more? I say it's a tealy. Tealy. Is it called kingfisher? I did not know that. I genuinely wow. didn't. Wow. I must be psychic. Yeah. Oatmeal. Oh, you know what? If Go you on. bought some of the patterns from, did you see the lovely? Did you see all the the? Um, it's all the characters. The character. Yeah. Uh, yes, Joseph Bears. Three o'clock this afternoon. You can watch the rewind. Cute. They're adorable, aren't they? They really were. And nice. we've been putting requests in, yeah. and she's actually making them. What, like what was your? Request? So um, I can't remember what my request was, funnily mm. enough. But Meg, really, our, one of our producers, wanted a puffin. A puffin a will puffin? be coming next time. Great, just but ah. let's give you an example. So, could we do something like this? Yes, exactly. Really? So there are What's patterns. This? Well, her, her, this is a wall plaque uh -huh. that she's made into a, like a key holder. But my What's point the, is, what dog is that? Though? Oh, it's a cockapoo, I think. A cockapoo. He was very popular earlier on. Oh, I mm. like cockapoos. Yeah. Have you ever met a cockapoo? I, I have not met a cockapoo. They are extremely lovable. Really? Yeah, they're very playful. Ah, oh, thanking you. Okay. But anyway, what I was thinking was, if you have got the patterns, then of course you can use these lovely colours. Yeah. Why not? Make your own kingfisher cockapoo. Well, they've also there's also some patterns for uh, unicorn on the website. What? Yes. Okay. Yeah. All so, right. Now right. we're talking. Yeah. Sixteen ninety though. You are getting all of these. Uh, they are a polyacrylic blend, so you're getting uh, seventy-five percent polyacrylic, twenty-five percent wool. So good wool content. So that means as well, you can put it in the wash and it won't shrink. It can. You can. Because you had an incident, didn't you? I had an incident with a very expensive. Which you keep, you keep getting reminded of. Poncho. What happened? You can't. We can't leave it there. Because it was merino wool, and I totally forgot. Don't put it in the wash. So I put it in the wash, and I've never seen anything like you know when they, they people say about oh it shrank to that. Yeah. I always thought that was in again another myth. Exaggeration. I literally when I got it out I went what the anyway and I took it in and I was like bereft because it had shrunk l that much and I took it There's into no the lounge. Back from that. No, and I showed my other half and first he didn't he couldn't quite work out what it was then he clocked and then 
He laughed his head off. I would have. He, I would have absolutely died on the floor laughing. Do you know what it was good though? If you if you knew anyone had a baby, suddenly a nice little baby poncho. No, the cat ended up sitting on it. <laughs> okay. This expensive poncho cat ended Ruby. up to the cat. That's like great, she's done it again. I'm going to sit <laughs> like a king. Um, sixteen ninety, your price for all the wool. Eight nine one two two eight, your item number. Yes. What have we got over here? Ah, oh, really nice cardstock. This is a nice kingfisher as well. It is actually. Yeah. yeah. It's called this, teal. This one's called teal. Okay, fair a, enough. A kingfisher teal. Good weight. Yeah, great weight. 300 years. Yes. So we can do our card blanks. It'll die cut really well. Yeah, stamp and emboss. Mm. Uh, good weight for construction for your gift boxes. Yes. Mm. Uh, you are getting 100 sheets for 11.99. So effectively 12 pence per sheet. Really? Oh, that's well done. Yes. <laughs> no, there the maths. Mm. Uh, 312704. But that's a lot. And of course, if you're a Freedom member, your postage is covered because that's quite weighty. Mm. It is. It is well. We'll put it to the test. I won't mess it. I won't mess it up. I won't mess it up. <gasps> Molly's like, hold, don't ruin the. I'm going to see if you can do this one-handed. Me. So if you just hold out one hand, oh, no. that'll stretch this like is, this. Oh no! This is going to be disaster. It's. All, uh, well, there we go. Oh, it's, it's not quite. Too bad. It is quite it heavy. It is quite heavy. Yeah. What you need to do yeah. is give it a little bit of the wobble and flick test. Go for it. Yeah. Good wobble. Nice. Good wobble. Oh, missed it. Oh. No, I missed. I missed. Sorry. Oh, perfect. Yes. Hear the echo. So, you know, you know. And when you get this home, we thoroughly advise you do your own, subject it to your own wobble and flick test. Yes. If it, that's what you want to hear mm. when you get it home. Uh, okay. Now, what have we got over here? Oh, we've got some lovely cardstock and also some tags and whatnot that you can cut out and decoupage. Uh, not decoupage, but you can cut out on yeah. that. Yeah, lovely colourways, aren't they? They do you know, These look. Are they die cut? In they're not. They're embossed. Oh, they're embossed. Yes. My goodness, they look so 3D mm. uh, on those. Wait, wait. Oh, I thought there were stickers for a minute as well. Yeah, they're, they're these are really nice. Yeah. So cut those out, have some fun. Quite uh, vintage. I like the uh, actual print too, lovely colours. Mm. Chuck goes really well with your dress. Thank you, and your shirt. Mm. It's as we're if a, we planned it. We're, we're, we've got a sort of purpley feel. Yeah, because yeah. everything at the moment is about green and red and gold. Yeah, but I think purple is actually quite a, a seasonal colour too. Well, in in the hallway at my mum's, because you mm. know I'm a Christmas nutter. You love your Christmas. Did you watch a show, by the way, with uh, the people who popped the Christmas lights? No. But you didn't Which see show? it. Which show? Uh, I'll tell you the details. Oh. It was on Trustful TV and okay. they follow three families yeah. who from October yeah. do you know the house where it's absolutely the whole whole community is this gather the around. One in, no, that's not the one in Hove near where I live, is it? Probably no, not. Okay, fine. Right. But it, you've got to watch it. Okay. There's people on your level of enthusiasm for <gasps> Christmas. Oh, okay. You'll like it. Good mm. stuff. Uh, 9 99 if you want to go for the 393 361, your item number. Now, we do have a thing called Freedom mm -hmm. at Ho Chanda, but what happens if people aren't familiar with Freedom? Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. I've got a minute or two to tell you why you should all be members of Ho Chanda Freedom. Did you know that with Ho Chanda Freedom, you could be saving on your deliveries every single month? For just a £6.97 monthly fee, you'll benefit from unlimited standard delivery, which means the more you spend with us, the more you save. And do you know the best bit? You can cancel at any time. Becoming a member of Hochanda Freedom, you'll also be able to take advantage of our exclusive Freedom Members discounts, where you can save anything up to 20% on an already fantastic Hochanda price. Freedom members will also receive our exclusive members badge and Freedom newsletter, which will keep you updated with all the goings on behind the scenes. Look at all these benefits for £6.97 per month. Over 12,000 of you are already members, and we thank you so much for being part of our family and sharing your crafting passion with us. In fact, I'm going to hand over to you to tell everyone else about your experience with Hochanda Freedom. I'm a Freedom member, which means I can shop a lot. It's the discounts and all the special offers you get. I get special offers, I get special discounts. They tell me when everything's happening. So if there's a special show I want to watch, then it's there. I'm able to just shop when I'd like. It's just good to have. But yes, you do save. If you buy like I do, you save. <laughs> you see, you could be a member instantly for £6.97 per month with no monthly obligation. So when you want to cancel, you can. Just give us a call or go to our website, quoting the item number 888888. So don't forget you get your unlimited standard delivery, exclusive freedom discounts, 
members badge and members newsletter. What are you waiting for? Join Hochanda Freedom today and become a member of the growing Hochanda family. Well, hello everybody. So I'm being joined by the lovely Lou. Hello. Hello, hello again. Hey, we had fun during the oh, one day special. We did. We had. Got to point out now, with regard to the one day special, the best thing you can do is go online right now, mm. search Studio Lights, have a look, shop ahead. I'll tell you why, because we were really busy uh, in the launch hour. Mm. Once items have gone, they have gone, and potentially we could see at nine o'clock tomorrow that we've actually lost certain items. This is what you're getting with the one day special. I mean, Lou, talk us through this. You're getting so much. You, I think you just spend it a tiny bit more than you are saving, aren't you? Yeah. And it's you've got access to two flexi payments, twenty-five pounds. Yeah, and then if you can push it to the next one that's set up with it, you've got something for every. You've got the whole set there. It's brilliant. See, those are cool. Those got those sort yeah. of vintage signs, uh, sort of vibe to them. Mm -hmm. So as we go through, that's a great background. Yeah. Gr another fantastic background. Yeah. And we only did that separately. Yeah. And the dies. Look at all these dies. Do you know it works out per die set and per stamp set? So what you're seeing there, that works out four pounds fifty-four. But that's it. This stamp set, four pounds fifty-four. This die set, four pounds fifty-four. Uh, this is breaking down. That's a, um, a card blank. There's about is nine that, dies in that. Isn't yeah, it? Is that card blank? Yeah, it goes through a card, and you can make it into a, a stand-up card, or you can make it into your journal. Uh, or you can make it into a little Tie Fighter. Yeah. Uh, and th look, this is like an old-school camera. Yeah, uh, that's a box brownie. That is a box brownie. That's that. really cool. I did this out of a thin metal and it yeah. looks brilliant. I know, we'll put yes, yeah, I remember that. I'm going to use this. And then there's a bit of pretty in there too. Yeah, and you can make it feminine or masculine. Yeah. All of those for 49 99 It genuinely was an incredibly popular launch for a yeah, one day special. Uh, and I think tomorrow you will start to see no. options fall. So, uh, my advice if you see something that you like, get it now. What are you going to be doing with Alex? Um, I'm going to do pretty with Alex. Pretty with, oh, I think very fitting. Two lovely pretty ladies. No, pretty, pretty. I'm, I'm all right, she's pretty. No, Lou. I tell you what though, I'm going to change grunge to nice grunge, which is like an oxymoron, isn't it? No. Grunge to pretty grunge. Yeah. Okay. Well, having some fun. I love that word. I don't what? know what it, I know what it means, but I can't what, remember. oxymoron? Yeah. yeah. It's like... It's, it's oxymoron is kind of, um... You're dead happy. Yeah. It's like it's two words that complete opposites That's put it. together, yeah, yeah, yeah. isn't it? That just just yeah. work. So Lou, we're gonna have some fun in the next hour. Yes. We've got lots lined up. What is it for you about studio lights that you love so much? Variety. I yeah. can work with lots of different designers and, and, and learn something all yeah. the time. Or some of those designers. I've got my You've what? I've got my own set coming out. What? Yeah. How come this is the first time I've heard about this? Did you not know? I wasn't going to release it yet, so but when, it, it when got it out, out on the internet. When uh, it out? Uh, my collection comes out on the 11th of Feb. And it's I all on journals and dies oh, and Lou, travel. That's going to be busy. Yeah, it's based on a lady called Gwen, Gertrude Bell, and um, she was a really, really important woman, but overlooked because she was female. And she made all the maps. She's like a, a little bit of Amelia Earhart figure. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. And she did, uh, they did a film called uh, Desert, Queen of the Desert. And okay. she, still to this day, they refer to the bell maps. And everyone thinks it's a male bell. Oh, and it's not, it's it Gertrude her. Bell. And you know how the Victorians and all them blooming dresses, shoes, uh, she was She's climbing those. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. So, I know it's Sorry, my and it's based on something called a Midori, which was a travel. Midori. Oh, a Midori okay. is a tra like a travel. It's yeah. a region, but yeah. it was based on a travel. That's coming up in February. Lou, thank you so much. Oh, We're no, thank move you. On. Have fun at eight. Thank look you. To that. Now, I'm just going to give you a reminder of our deal of the day. Take a look at this. So, deal of the day, very very busy. You're getting your brush, you're getting your paints, all for thirteen forty one. I mean, how much would you pay just for the paints alone? The fact that you're getting the brush as well in there. Uh, Lou's just got her hands on them and she's, I mean, Lou, good value, right? Yeah. Mm. Uh, 595 your price, uh, sorry, 595, 500 your item number. Take a look, that's our deal of the day, very busy.
<laughs> wow, isn't it lovely, Chantilly? I know. You've got a nice hour lined up. But I'm well. Ch I'm so chuffed for Lou that she's got her own I range. Know, it's incredible. Mm. Uh, Thanks. Oh. She just said Alex is like hashtag winning. Uh, <laughs> hashtag you know, now you're going to be winning if you go for the first option. So sunset special. What we try and do is give you something that is great. Uh, this is brought to you by Heidi Swap. Look great in a room. Oh yeah, wouldn't they? Can we do the lights? Can we do the lights? Yeah, Can we do the okay. lights? So let's just. Oh oh. Sorry. I've, oh, has I've, it just I've, come off the yeah, reel? I was I've, like, oh, sorry. I unwound it. Okay. So if you hold that up, I'll hold this up. So these are the neon oh. lights that you have. Where you go? Oh, you're going to wrap it around you. Okay. All right. And there. Just showing you here. So they are on. And do you see that? So Alex is officially flashing. I am. I'm flashing. Oh. Oh, is it on a mic? My, my mic, sorry. There you uh, go. But you can yeah, see. Nice. So that's what you're going to wrap up uh, and put into your dreams <laughs> and then create your own design. So Lovely. it's kind of like it's home decor. Yeah. Mm. There is uh, an extended delivery on this. We can only apologise because of Christmas coming from abroad. It's going to be a three week delay. Yeah. Okay. So but. You know, it's worth waiting for. Yeah. And the full instructions are on the back for you. There you go. So you can see which way you thread it. Um, or, of course, you don't have to. You could just use the neon if you wanted. But anyway, really good deal. Oh, and yeah. it is <laughs> 40... How much is it? £14.98. Pence. Yes. Now, when are you going to get your eyes checked? Shh. I did. Yeah, and what do they say? Do you need glasses? Um, Alex. Is it because you don't want? Because once you start wearing glasses, your eyes relax. Well, hang on. See, mm. this is this is how the this is how the optician spoke to me. Now you know, Alex. Mm. It's a myth. I don't think it is. Well, you know, let whatever you. Think, everyone, but everyone I know who has glasses, they constantly having to get stronger prescription. Because mm. I think your your eyes get lazier and lazier and lazier. Mm. So as long as you can, you see all right. Can yeah. you see me? Yes, I can see well, you. You're okay then. <laughs> uh, right, now let's move on. Now okay. you're saying that someone's actually looking ahead to this. I'm sure somebody was. I saw it somewhere. But yeah, because this is your We Are Memory Keepers and it's a brand that loads of people love. Um, and what you can do is sort of use this as a to make your stitches. Have you got the instructions We've got there? the instructions here. Just having a little look. Yeah. There you go. So we can see how you work it, if you've not seen it mm -hmm. before. And then you've got your templates that mm -hmm. you punch out. Yep. Just down there. And they're, they're in here for you. Okay, so you've got all those swatcher templates, and you've even got the, uh, I like the frame too, so you can work with the templates. So the template slot into the frame, mm. and then you're just punching down, and you're using your thread on there. It's a very nifty piece. Oh, yeah, you're very nifty. You've got your threader on mm. there too. Yeah. Very nifty. It feels good in the hand. Does it? Ergonomic. Ergonomic. We'll have your head around that. What do you reckon? Okay. Yep, very nice. Ergonomically yeah. designed. Good so size. I guess you just. Punching away, yeah, like Just that. Because it's on the box. Let's show you on the box. Mm. Sort of some of the, some of the designs. There you go. You can see, like so. All right, 1999-474-953 is your item number. Uh, moving on, we have got our happy threads. Yeah, to go along with this one as well. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so you're getting lovely colours. Did, did you say there was a little bit of a metallic? I option? think this one is. Look. Yeah, this one's Gold. got a little bit of. Gold. Oh, and you're getting your corresponding bobbins as well. Mm -hmm. So what would you be using these for, Alex? Why well, I, I don't know. I'd more be using the actual thread. See, for me, because I'm not a soft craft. Well, so, so not soft craft. Obviously, you know, I do my cross stitch and or, and embroidery and sparkle stitch cards. Do but a, I don't have a sewing machine. Oh, see, so you know, I don't do that type of soft craft. Get a sewing machine. Yeah, but I can't. I can't oh. fit it all in, Yanis. This is the problem. Oh. And I tell you what. Yet okay. again. Yeah. When Tony came up the other week, I went out with a but Sorry, I bought these. Oh. <laughs> He's like, stop it. Have, so, you, yeah. have you got a little crafty room at home? Yeah. Yeah, and it's full to rafters. Yeah. A lot of people at home can associate. I know. They can feel your pain. Uh, Fifteen ninety six. You're getting all four of those. Six six eight one zero six. Your item number. Now mm. something else. We've got. <laughs> that's not how you do it, Molly. What's she doing? It's uh, to fan it out. You know oh. the, the little. Uh, There's a technique. It's smaller, smaller circles. She's just like. <laughs> I <it> was like. <laughs> uh, okay, now let's open this up and have a little look. Okay, it's got your metallic on it as well. Mm -hmm. Here you go. There you go. Just showing you here, and look at the. <laughs> so, just have a look. <laughs> looks a bit dodgy where we put it up I and know. we don't say anything. I know. Okay, <laughs> but just give me that wiggle, and when the gold comes through. 
Oh, yeah. You can see it. And I it's like got a really it. good weight. These would make really nice curtains, I think. Yeah, I, th I, I actually agree. Yeah. Do you know, I'd be tempted then, if you're going to make curtains, because think how much curtains cost. Yeah. Easily, yeah. Get two or three. Absolutely. Four. Yeah. Because mm. uh, you're saving twenty pounds, aren't you? I mean, look, you, you, you can got... fold now, by the way. Okay. That, That's fair. Fezzies. Yeah. Fezzies. Go on then. So look, when you can see, if you've got four, how much? How much? I spent a fortune on curtains. Yeah. They you know, I I shop bought ones and what? No, or made got, to measure I ones. I got sorry. made to measure Did ones. you? Did when you? When I first, when I moved into my first flat, I spent. Like, it would have been a couple of thousand on curtains. Wow. I know. They saw me coming. They, wow. Yeah. It was a family friend as well. <laughs> True. <laughs> You've been and then I saw someone else. I was like, okay, they're obviously a family friend. They'll, yeah. they'll make sure I'm okay. And then a friend moved into place. They said, oh, I just went to a local shop, a couple of hundred quid. It's like, what? I know. Hey ho. Well, well. At you least you love your curtains. Yeah, look, I do. Yeah. Still got them. Still got them. <laughs> Listen, for that price, I'm going to have them for another 20 Life. years. Like it. Yeah. Okay. So there we go. Okay. That's uh, your uh, that's your fabric. Now we've got some dyes for you. Twenty dyes in total, all with a lovely sort of sewing and knitting theme. Uh, you've even got a little book. Is the border related? Oh, yeah. It's like cross stitch. Oh, yeah, that's clever. It's just for you, Alex. Yeah. The cross, cross stitch. stitch and like little um, normal stitch. <laughs> <laughs> running stitch, running thank stitch. you. I couldn't think I of the word. I wish the viewers could have seen the uh, my action demonstration of the running stitch. Yeah, because I do definitely like, sit. I do definitely sit in my hotel room doing sure this, and I'm go. sorry. It's like, it's like you're doing the electric boogaloo. What is this? The electric boogaloo. Isn't that it? What? Yeah, it's a dance move from the 80s. No. Okay, just me. Uh, having a look here, and come on, has no one else heard of that no, move? No, I, 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 well, I didn't know it was called that. Yeah. But I've seen the move. I thought, I thought, or oh, maybe some people call it the wave. I don't know, maybe. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Uh, Ten ninety nine your price, saving fourteen pounds. Double uh, triple zero one four six your item number. Oh, okay, Alex. Oh, you, sorry, I've just wandered you just off. Disappear without me. This is what I normally do. Sorry. <laughs> just gone. <laughs> yeah. uh, now we got some yarn balls. Yes. Mm. Um, so we've got. Five of the oatmeal, have we? Yeah. And five of the kingfisher. Ten in total. So, yes. Good. I mean, these are a nice chunky knit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice for jumpers, scarf. Very nice for oh, scarf and jumper. Actually, would you blend the two together? Oh, I don't know. I don't so know. Should we blend them together? What do you reckon? Mm. They're all right, but the point is, you know, you can choose yeah. whatever you want to do. Molly's having a good look. She's she's whether, she is. Yeah. She's not sure. Molly, thumbs up or down? On their own, yeah. But on their own. Okay. So on their own. She's very, very, very uh, clear about that opinion. Yeah, she was. Yeah. I mean, no messing around, no blending at all. Look, it's the oatmeal and this kingfisher by itself. That's it. Okay, but mm -hmm. you get to decide whatever works for you. Sixteen mm -hmm. ninety. Now, again, that's good value for money. Absolutely. And of course, they will. You can wash this. You know, if you've made your items, but we won't talk about mm -hmm. the poncho again. Um, so you can pop it through the washer yeah. and shrink. Yes. Do you know, you're saving twenty-eight pounds. That's really good. I know. But only until the end of the hour. £1.69 per yarn ball. Mm -hmm. now, only until the end of the hour. How much would you pay? Considering, I think you'd be doing well just to find a fully polyacrylic yarn ball, uh -huh. uh, ball for uh, that price. The fact that you've got 25% wool content in there Very as well. Very good. Mm. Indeed. And your item number is 891228. Then we've got some cardstock that's been fanned out. It has been fanned out. Uh, now, we have had an email in from Steve-O. Oh, Aww. hi, Steve-O. The, oh, the, the, the first witch. tablet, the, the fabric, fabric yeah. yeah, would look great as a wall hanging. That is a really nice idea, especially the metallic yeah. bit. That's lovely. Thank you, Steve-O. He's got a good eye on Steve-O. Yeah. He's also saying a room divider. Oh. Now, well, that's quite good. Oh, yeah. yeah. Nice idea, Steve-O. In the lovely. presenter room, someone needs to get changed. That's true. Yeah. Instead of just the curtain. Curtain, see through, see see through, through curtain. curtain. It go. is actually see through. <laughs> How we live. Yeah. Uh, okay, now tell us about this. Uh, well, it's cardstock yeah. and it's got a good flick test. Oh, flickability, wobble wobbleability. Test. You have uh, you've developed, you've taken your wobble to a whole different level. Have I? Why? Yeah. What's your wobble? Well, I think you'd. Um, I, I I tend to. Well, I'm just copying you now, actually. Well. I kind of. Uh, maybe I know. I go. I go. Maybe I'm copying Janice, possibly. She likes to, to do yeah. a good wobble. You need it, and it really highlighting that 300 mm. gra uh, GSM. Yes, you mm. are. So, good colours, too. I really like it. I'd like to stamp and emboss some gold. 
embossing powder on this. I think yeah. I think that, that looks really. Um, so imagine that So make your, make your card blank. Yeah. Stamp and uh, oh, embossed gold would look. So, that's really nice. Because I, I think it's stunning. luxurious kingfisher and gold. Yeah. Mm. It's opulent. Op oh, I like that word. Mm. Yeah, it's good. It's decadent. Oh, that's another yeah. good word. You, you got any more? Um. Uh, Great. It's great. Eleven. That's nice. Uh, Eleven ninety nine. Your price there. Saving fifteen pounds. It is genuinely a very good card stock. Yeah. Uh, three. Oh, should we, oh, Jeff, we tore it. If it's a call. Should we tear? Well, we can see. Just so you know, at home, there is. A. There is. So there we go. You've even got the core in there as well. Nice. So uh, showing you the quality of the cardstock. Okay, we can't. We've got to hide that one now. <laughs> uh, let's move on, shall we? Okay, dokey. Uh, so the next thing we've got is again. Now, uh, what I didn't mention earlier on is this actually has a texture. This lovely, these lovely papers. Oh yeah. They do, it's and they're like a tooth. Really nice colourway, don't they? Mm. All the purples they all work and the pinks. Together. Yes, they're all from the same shade, density, and pigment base. Well, somebody's been doing her research. No, that is because I used to work as a colour analyst. What? Didn't you know this? No, I did not know this. Yeah. What? Here we go again, they say. Everybody in the world knows this except you, but go now on, you know. Me. So it's about like the colours of clothes that so suit you. So you used to be a colour analyst? Yeah. So I would come to you and you tell me what colours suit me. But I'd have different. <laughs> and I'd have different, but you, you test, you get tested with different shades of drapes under your chin. Yep. And some drapes, some shades of colour will make you literally light up uh -huh. and give you clear, fresh skin. Mm. And some shades of colour can drain you. Wow. And of course, you want to avoid those ones. So, too. what colours work for you? Purples? Yeah, anything you see me in, basically. Uh, okay, like, you won't you see know. me in yellow. Ah. And you won't see me in orange. Okay. Only unless it's for a part, because I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get fired down. by the director. You've got new yeah. Wizard of Oz. Yeah. Oz, yeah. yeah. Okay. So they get. So this is from the company I used to work for. Is the Summer Palette. The Summer Palette. Yes. Beautiful colours. Yeah. Nine ninety nine. You're also getting the embossed uh, sort of uh, elements that you can obviously fussy cut. Now these aren't die cut. No. But you can fussy cut. But they them, have right? got like a, an embossed to them. Yeah. They're really nice. Three of each sheet there as well. Uh, okay, details on your screen, saving 20 pounds. Pounds. Uh 393 361, your item number. Lovely. We do have Tracy Evans coming up soon. Yes, mm. for the craft along. Uh, this is happening on the 19th of January at two o'clock for two hours. Oh, I wonder who's going to be doing it as in like who the presenter is because I haven't done one yet and I'd really like to do a craft along. No, have you done one? Yeah, uh, oh. yeah. I did one with Hayley. Did you? Which Hayley? Yeah, our, our Hayley. Our Hayley. Yeah. Ah. So we did um, with the sewing machine, the Husqvarna right. Viking. Lovely. Jade. See, I'd really like to do that. Anyway, the 37th, the, um, sorry, the Craft Along project is on screen. Those are your stamps. £37.97. and pence. Do get them now and then you can enjoy and craft along on the 19th of January. 993-235 is your item number. And next up we have got some All Stars. So we're going to say hello to so, now. Apologies, I think a few people were struggling to get into a chat room earlier on. So uh, just and, having a well, look. chat room or Facebook live. Yeah. So we've got Diamond, of course, is there. Uh, Sarjan, Robert, uh, Jackie. Who else have we got? Mm. Obviously, Steve-O. I'm sure Dave and Brig. Dave and Brig, thanks oh. for the cake. Did, wait. It's in the kitchen. Oh, is that from Dave and Brig? Yes. I didn't want to touch it because I didn't know who it was from. Now, can I just say, right, so our director, Behu, his name's yeah. Alex, but it gets confusing, so yeah. Behu, uh -huh. uh, went and got every single piece to try them all, and a mince pie as well. Wow. Um, Behu this is was, Alex who's going to do his own health kick this uh, Apparently, this year. yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's Christmas. Well, they are healthy, Christmas. though. Yeah. You know, they're healthy because they they're they vegan. Actually, they're vegan. Yeah, yeah. But he said um, his he, banana cake was his favourite, Dave and Brick, so there you go. Oh. Uh, Emily said her favourite was apple. Nice. Oh, I'm going to have to try one on my drive home. Yes, yes. You mm. take one. Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, do we not have a little on it? Well, I'm still, still saying hello. And there's Dawn. <laughs> Sorry, only there's Dawn, saying? there's Sylvia. No, really. <laughs> right, I'll carry on now. Thank you uh, very now, much. With that All Stars, now this was earlier on, I'll tell you, a real All Star Did for me. Did you do this show? I did, oh, with lovely. Leone. So we did it with Leone. Very, very, very popular. So La Blanche, mm. you know how popular oh, La Blanche yeah. is. Uh, and uh, this is just one of the items, and you're getting an awful lot for your money. So, firstly, I want to show you this set here, because what we haven't got with us are the uh, clear um, 
stickers. It kind of gives it a cavachon. Oh, they're, they're right, cavachon, yeah. So we're yeah. describing them as the clear epoxy stickers, but they're shaped, they're sort of faceted. Yeah. So you put them over these and you can kind of line them over the, uh, cut these out and it makes it look like a cavachon. So right. instant vintage effect. You're going to love this next one though. Go on then. Ba -ba. Oh, that's nice. Work. And then you've got your 12 by 12s in the mix as well. Really nice, gritty, grungy 12 by 12s. Lovely. Uh, not only that, you are getting some embellishments, metal embellishments in the mix. And you've got the flowers too. So you'll be getting the metal embellishments that we're seeing here. And you've got the flowers. These are great samples, aren't they? Yeah, Sorry, the Blanche Leanne, samples got this... are always fantastic. Wow. What, did she send them over? Yeah. Oh, bless her. Oh, look at that. Her, her, like you said, her gorgeous um, products are always so fabulous. Look at these. We've got this one. Uh, so, 11.99. Mm -hmm. That's what you're getting for 11.99. 423.597 is your item number. They're lovely, aren't they? They're very, very nice. So we're having a look at our All Stars. That was La Blanche. Now, we're going to show you something that we alluded to a little earlier on. This is very different. Cool. Oh, and I must give a shout out. I've just seen that Adam. Hello, Adam. He's he's yeah. uh, he's chatting it, online. Humphreys. Yes, oh, presenter. Okay, presenter. Yeah. Adam, how are you doing? But I have not seen Adam because he's like my counterpart. Oh, see. So when see he's working, I'm off, and vice versa. Yeah, yeah. So I just I haven't seen Adam in ages, months. But you have worked with him a, yeah. a couple of times. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, mm. that's good. Yeah. Uh, now, oh. Cutie level, 10 out of 10. This is, you heard about uh, Alex saying the jumper that shrunk. We found it <laughs> and we stuck a dog on it. No, <laughs> That's not mine. <laughs> this is cute. So we've got, now this is from uh, Joseph Bear Designs. Yeah. I love these. So we can, that is fantastic. Isn't it? So what she's done is basically she gives you the kit and you can find them online to make, uh, so we've got these options. Look at you straight. Oh, this is very cute. So you can make, you've got these options here of your cockapoo, mm -hmm. border collie, spaniel and the, the poodle. poodle. Yeah. He's gone a bit wonky, now, I which think. Would you, which, would you, which would you like to make? I, yeah, this one was crazy today, and he still is, and I would go for this one. Now, what, do you know what she's done? Which is Because oh. I touched it, and I was like, hang on a minute. What she did, she, she brushes the, 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 the wool, right, yeah. or the yarn, but then, if you feel that bit... Oh, she put, like, a maybe She's put spray, hairspray spray on it. it. So he's been coiffured, or whatever oh. the, the word is. But what she said was, uh, so in the kit, you'll get um, the plaque as well, so you mm -hmm. can make them as plaques, but she also wanted to show you that you don't have to have them as plaques. That's why she's popped the head on the, the jumper and the key hanging, you the see. The key hanging is really cool. Yeah. Using the cockapoo. Mm -hmm. Look at that. And they're all they're crocheted, these ones, and um, Barbara said, really easy to do. A beginner could do it. You get full instructions. Wow. Yeah. Um, so you can check. Yes, yeah, so you do also get the safety eyes you get and the, the nose. nose. You get the yeah, because that's, that's what you might there. struggle to find. Mm. They're very good. so any dog lover, fantastic. But not even just for dog lovers. Oh no, not at all. They're they're fabulous. And if you go and look online, there's other things. There's cushions. Uh, there's bags, handbags yeah. that have wow. dog heads. It's amazing. That. Come on, it's different, so isn't different. it? Yeah. Would you would you rock a handbag with a, a with a I would on it? because I like unusual. Yeah, like I that's my thing. Favorite breed of dog? Have you got a favorite? Well, I'm a bit biased because I used to have a Cavalier King, Cavalier King Charles. Oh, yeah, they're, w w they're really nice dogs, right? They're, yeah. Well, look, they my dog was so nice. He let the burglars in. What? No barking. No, nothing. Go and give him a lick. Yeah, literally just, hi guys. Yeah, hey. this was a long time ago. Nobody really steals microwaves oh. anymore. But anyway, yeah, come in. The Take TV's the over there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. But they, did, they didn't hurt the doggy. No. Yeah, no okay, he just, he was, no. They were, I think they were quite grateful. A bit of company. Yeah, yeah you know, let the burgers in. Uh, <laughs> right, we're just going to give you some details of the kit. So, uh, you cockapoo, these are your choices. You can either go for the cockapoo, the border collie, the spaniel, or the poodle. Choice is yours. Fourteen ninety nine. You're getting instructions, uh, and you're getting the kits in there. For fourteen ninety nine. I think that is very good value for money. Yep. See, you're getting instructions and all the other accoutrement to make your board, your dog. Accoutrement. Very mm. nice. Ah, oh, Julie Hickey was in. She's so good. Did you get to work with her today? I did. Oh, uh, amazing. I've had a really good day. You have. Um, now, with Julie Hickey, there was a lot of talk, people asking for a craft along with her. Yes, I heard about that. I think that would be that. amazing. I think that would be really good. She's so passionate about crafting and, and so knowledgeable. Yeah, I was going to say informative, mm. which is great. 
Yeah. Oh, right, so in this set, you're getting, is it this right? Have I got yeah. this right? Two sets of flowers. Okay, and the hexagon die. Righty ho. Okay, there so that's are. one bundle, 1897. Now, I want to put this into context. Effectively, you're getting the dies free in really? that price. So nine pounds, you're, sorry, not the dies, the uh, stamps. Okay. So. Uh, so you've covered your dies and uh, 1897, the stamps are a bonus. But the, just putting this down for a second yeah, go for it. and showing you what you can make with the hexagon. So you can do something like this. Yes, that card, that's beautiful, isn't it? I like different shaped cards. Yeah, very, very nice. Now we've also got another set that was extremely popular. Wait till you see this price, okay, Alex. Okay. But as a crafter, have a look at that price. Oh, 11 48 For both. For the stamps and the dies. For your stamps and your dies. And look, it's, this is the attention to detail mm. that you get with Julie. She was sort of saying, um, you know the, the petals here? She could have just given you one, but then mm. you have to do the flower. You have to run it through several times. Oh, so, yeah. nope, I'm going to give you a set of three. So yep. she puts so much thought into everything. And that's an example, actually. Yeah, I was going to say, you can see the, this is a lovely card. But of course, not just for your cards, uh, home decor, mixed media, yeah. lovely. Very, very nice. Just a really beautiful, dainty set. Oh, yeah. Oh, very nice. There we go. Thank you. Oh, I like that. Yeah, that's nice and I like the white space. Nice and yeah. clean and simple. You can tell you're an experienced crafter because well, it's not having the fear of the white space. When yeah. All of us, when we start out, you feel you have to fill everything. Well, I mean, even Matthew Palmer was saying, yeah. oh, black canvas, you know, yeah, that's yeah. what people feel. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay, so there we go. Julie Hickey, <clears throat> all the hours, by the way, that we showed you, if you go onto our website, have a look at the schedule, and you can recap <laughs> on any of the hours, and it's well worth it. Uh, the hour with Julie Hickey, I thought, was fantastic. <clears throat> well, oh, right. Uh, we've got our deal of the day coming up. So, deal of the day. Now, mm. look, let's just break this down because what you're getting here, are you a fan of Matthew Palmer? Have you already maybe got some of his pre-blended uh, watercolours? The quality of this, these are artist quality. Mm. Really good value for money. And you're getting the silver liner brush in there as well. Yeah. Mm, or oh. silver worker brush. Worker brush. It's size six, I believe. Mm -hmm. Yep. And they've been specially formulated, these colours, by Matthew. He's taken a lot of time to... Uh, very nice brush stroking there, Yanis. Just a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> uh, really, it's, the, the key is the natural uh, feel of the colours. Mm, yeah, that's it. Look at that. So mm -hmm. you're getting the potter pink, potter blue, and the potter green. Like you said, it's all in nature. So your trees. So rather than being like the stark greens, yeah. it's like it We've is. all done it. You know, as a kid, yeah. you put in like, uh, you take a green felt tip yeah. or green paint, and it's just a really, really sort of bright stroking on neon green. Mm. Yeah. It doesn't look like a leaf. No. This is very natural. And also your blues uh, and the brown in there, the potter's brown, very natural colours. So think for your landscapes, your yeah. seascapes, fantastic. Yeah, all mm. good. Uh, and the brush as well. If you go and please have a look, see if you're local, next time you go to a local, if you are an artist, your local art shop, see how much you'd pay for uh, paint. You'd get half as much and probably pay twice as much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's very, very good value for money. Because that's got a £16.39 pence saving. That mm -hmm. is the saving, which is really good. £13.41 pence is all you're paying. Uh, 595500 is your item number. And of course, uh, you are watching Good Evening Hachanda. So, now, do you know what? One of our most popular sunset specials, and I think mm -hmm. it's courtesy of your flick and wobble, Thank you. is Thank our you. papers. I'll, I'll hand over to you. Okay, right, here we go. It's a good flick and a wobble. Look, jokes aside, beautiful colour, yeah. 300 GSM cardstock, and you're getting an awful lot. So if you just want to stop up on your stash, oh, that's loud. Uh, there, because it's such a good weight, we can die cut, we can make our card blanks if we want as well. So make your own card blanks. You said something. Yeah. Um, you talked about a golden boss. I think that would be deal. lovely because I just think Beautiful. it's really opulent. There you go. Yeah. That's what we were talking about. But those two colours together. Mm. So they kind of remind me of peacock feathers. Yeah. Even though peacocks, I don't think, have gold in their feathers, but still. Well, you can imagine stamping on this, and it mm. is very, very smooth. So I think that would stamp beautifully. I think so too. Uh, 
get an emboss on there, have some fun, but it's just good quality cardstock to add to your stash. Mm. Uh, and that's what we're all about here, is bringing you quality, and that's yeah, important. It is. Uh, so it's 300 GSM, as mm -hmm. we've said. Really nice, big wadge. If you're a Freedom member, big, big wadge. <laughs> it's a wadge of paper. It is. Um, 300 GSM, if you're a Freedom member, of course, you're not paying for your postage. Mm -hmm. And you've only got... Um, you've only got about eight minutes left before the prices of all of our sunset specials go up. Eleven ninety nine. That's fifteen pounds off. Well worth stocking up on that. Very nice. Uh, do you want to say any hellos? <clears throat> yes. What's the conversation been? Oh. Diamond said, sorry, Alex, your flick and wobble d just doesn't do it for me. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> I bet Scott's is better. Scott's stroking. Yes, fabric is legendary. Is but you think again with your flick and wobble. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, let's see. I'm just saying hello to everybody. Everybody's just having a lovely little chat, which is so nice. Um, chatting, oh, I think, oh, Adam's on there chatting about his little girl. Aww. Yeah. Oh, was she Does better? She better? Apparently. She cold? Did she have a cold? I don't know. I just know. Oh, oh, okay. Hopefully well, better. hopefully she's better there. Uh, but hello, Beth, as well, mm -hmm. and Dawn. It's lovely to have your company. Good. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, we hope you're all well. We were just talking about the fact there seems to be a bit of a Hochanda lurgy. Is there? Breaking. Yeah, a yeah. few people getting. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I hope we don't have a. Hope we don't get a Christmas one. Christmas lurgy. No. Don't want no Christmas lurgy. But I want Christmas turkey. Oh, Christmas. I Thank like you. What you did. I like what you did there. Thank you. Leg or breast? Leg. Really? Leg and thigh. Leg and thigh. I'm a leg and thigh girl. Breast. Mm. Yeah, there we go. Choices. Uh, let's have a look at what's coming up tomorrow. What have we got to look forward to, Alex? Uh, what? Oh, hang on. What have we got? So you've <laughs> We've got to got get those glasses. I know. It's the monitor's too you far You can away. see that, though, right? Um, Alex. It's a little bit blurry. You need to get no, glasses then. Come on, if you can't All see right. that. All right, so a uh, good morning, Hachanda. And then we've got, oh, our Julia's in. Oh, no, is it Paul Paula doing it? Yeah. Oh, do you, of course, Julia's guessing. Of course, she is, but Paula's hosting. That's yeah. right. That's where I get, get confused. Um, so we've got Sentimentally Yours Big Save. Uh, then we've got, of course, the studio lights with our Lou. We'll see what's left because it's been doing really, really well. <laughs> then we've got Handmade by Hayley Big Save. Uh, Big Save with Artistic Flair. Paula's mm -hmm. hosting that one. Sentimentally Yours again. Studio light. What's tomorrow's launch? Oh, sewing Big Save One Day Special. I wonder who's doing that. Oh, is it Hayley Smith? Ah, yes, I think that, that rings a bell, actually, because <laughs> yeah. I was with her the other day. She said she's back in. Are you all right, Alice? Yeah, I'm good. Uh, lots of, I'm just thinking, like, how many Hochandas are presenting? Yes. Why is this? <laughs> I, don't, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It's because sometimes our names aren't on the schedule. Oh, uh, that's worrying. Mysterious. Oh, oh mysterious. Because you never know. You never know what will happen. Might swap the hours around. Yes. Uh, have you had fun? I've had lots of You've fun. You've got a good hour to look forward to next. I have. Lou Withers' mm -hmm. one day special studio lights yeah. big save event. Now, a big save event kicks off today at six. Well, it's it going to run yeah. until when? the 1st of, of January. Oh, really? All the way through? All the way through. Oh, so that's good. I mean, monster savings. I know. Yeah. Um, we're even on on Christmas Day as well. We are. Are you mm -hmm. looking forward to that? Well, I'll be at home. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I, I'm going to be doing a bit of Christmas Day. I know Haley's there as well. Uh, I've lovely. got a show with uh, Barbara. Have Christmas you? Day. Yeah, I'm looking nice. forward to that. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So. And are you all set for Christmas? Yeah, I think I am. Tom got all the presents. Really? Yeah. Tomorrow's my one day off. I've got to do some stuff. Have you? What, Mrs. Christmas? Yeah. You surely you're prepared? No. Really? No. Have you got presents? I've got some. Does Tony watch? Uh, yes. You know, you oh, know, well, know you know what I've Tony got. Tony knows what you've got in as well. <laughs> because he's just expecting <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's good price. Uh, good price. Good uh, present. Good there. present. Yeah. Hope you're all set. But if you're not, we're going to be keeping you company uh, here. Now, we've got lots to look forward to. We were talking about our craft along with Tracy Evans. Yes. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. uh, by the way, Tracy Evans, such a talented crafter. Uh, we're going to show oh. you a little bit about that. The whole concept Excellent. of Thank craft along. You. Can you believe craft longs now? They feel like they've been at Hochanda forever. What? About a year old, the it's concept. About a year, yes. Mm. Um, and I think Barbara started it, didn't she? It was in January. Yeah. yeah. So just showing you here now, Tracy Evans. So what we do with a craft along is we uh, give you everything you need to make a project from start to finish. With um, and that's the great thing, having talented artists and crafters who give you that start to finish mm. instructions. Absolutely. And these are the stamps that, if you order, you'll be able to craft along with. Uh, with Tracy uh, on the day, which is the 19th of January at 2 o'clock. 
37 pounds and 97 pence is the price and it's 933 nine three three two three five that's is. what it is Alex I was a pleasure are you in tomorrow I am are you in tomorrow <coughs> no oh cost no death sorry are, are, are you in thing. Friday yeah I'll see, see you Friday. I see you Friday. Bring a secret Santa in. Oh yes. Yeah, mm, secret Santa Friday. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Alex. So coming up next, we do have our studio lights big save one day special with Alex and Lou. It's going to be a fantastic hour. Then we're going to add some sparkle into your life with Rob. Uh, after that, we have our studio lights big save one day special. Hi, this is Els from Elizabeth Craft Designs. Elizabeth Craft Designs is a Colorado-based company. It's a family company, so husband, son, daughter all work in the company and then a fantastic team of designers because a company cannot exist without a great team around yourself. What we would like to share with you is my passion for crafts. We love all the concepts we have, so we have from cute till classic and beautiful designs. We love our journaling planner line and we are going to bring you our ideas, our passion and we hope to transfer that passion to you. So please join Elizabeth Craft Designs here at Hochenda. Welcome to Club G45 from Graphic45, the monthly tutorial kit that allows you to create some of the most beautiful projects by accessing a step-by-step -step video viewable online. This month's tutorial is the Club G45 Life's a Journey Wrap Folio and Tag Trio kit, containing the Life's a Journey Wrap Folio and the Life's a Journey Tag Trio kit projects. You'll get almost everything you need to create these projects from scratch, including access to this month's step-by-step -step video tutorial and accompanying project sheet. Simply order yours by purchasing item number 176628 for £42.99, plus your postage from herchanda.com. Or give us a call on 01733 602000 for instant access to this month's Club G45 from Graphic45. Join us this Christmas. Where you will discover, be inspired, and get involved. Merry Christmas. From your home of crafts, hobbies, and art. You're right, Luke. I am. <laughs> hey, that was oh, bless you! Because I haven't seen you for a while. No, actually, I think we've been ships in the night. Yes, we? yes. You're but on your shift, and I'm on. Well, I'm just doing my own little thing. <laughs> your own little thing. <laughs> right. So I hear you had a very busy one day special yes. launch, and I'm really pleased because um, this was maybe some some people missed out last time, right? Because it did sell out, but it was earlier on, and I was saying to Leone in uh, Facebook Live, sometimes. You need a couple of more um, ODSs to people get into your thing. I think, yeah. oh, I really like Studio Light now. Mm, so bringing it back, they get to see. Yes, so because brands build here, that's absolutely. what we find. We yeah. absolutely find. So with the one-day special, yeah. it's, all, it's called industrial. Um, so you've got six stamp sets and five die sets. So that works out at 24 stamps in total and 21 dies in total. So do you want to talk us through the designs, yeah. Lee? Absolutely. We've got something for your journal, like the Arrow one. Is that that? Yeah. yeah, you can make that into a, a little fold-up card or a journal. But within that, Alex, you've got two layering dies each end and then two layering dies in the middle right so these are all like multiples and then this one here has got an amazing I'm going to do some stuff with today all the little cogs that we're going to make it to flowers and Lovely. then we've got a, a big uh, flower heart and then we've got one at this side which um, 
this one just looks like cogs, but it's actually got a line that goes all the way around it as well. Oh. So it's it cuts in and out, if that makes any sense to it people. It does, it does, yes. So even that looks good, but I did it out of, um, I did this, and then I cut a piece out of copper, so mm -hmm. you can see it now. Yeah. Um, and then put the two back together, and it really looked Looks good. good. Mm, really good. Nice. So you've got lots of, and then the stamps just, you can make them as pretty or as grungy as you want really. Indeed, so let's have a look at these because you said you're doing pretty grunge. Yeah, today. I am and, and just for a change. Well, I, I think it's pretty but it still might be grungy. Oh, no, I like my grunge. Yeah, yeah I do. Um, so look, you've got the gear, that's a great Brr. background stamp. Absolutely. That. Love the um, drips. Well, we only did one before with that and she turned it right one way and then the other way and it looks like, oh no it's not there, um, and it looked like fabric mm. and it looked really clever. So Again, I was so pleased when we sat talking, and, and, and again, when I'm working with you, you, we bounce all these ideas off. Yeah, it's lovely. It is, it's really clever. Yeah. Um, so, there are uh, two payments of £25, £46 saving. Uh -huh. That is the saving. So, I don't think this is going to hang around very long. This is your chance to get it. The usual price is £95.99. Mm. You're paying nowhere near that. £49.99 or two instalments of £25. 767482 is your item number. Then we've got Industrial 2.0. If you can stretch to both, because yeah. they work in tandem. Well, even if you do, it opens up a basket, doesn't it? Of course. Yes, yeah, so you can do flexi order and all of that. And these are. Um but it, th these all work in tandem, so you've got industrial and two and then three, but they also work with the other lines that we've got. So yeah. if you wanted to grunge up maybe one Janini's or these are some other designers, they all work together. Right. And Sandra, can you repeat that for me? If you want it on, if you want both th this one and the one day special, the flexi would be 37.49. And you're getting a lot there, right? Yeah. You are indeed. I love that you've got the nail heads, everything. And the the, um, the train. Now, I've got a question for you, because yep. as soon as I saw this, me and Janice, yes, oh, sorry, Janice and I, yeah. <laughs> to be uh -huh. correct, Janice and I, we were on Good Evening Hachanda the uh -huh. other day. We can't remember the name of what this metal's called. It, well, it's not corrugated. There's a special word for it. If oh, you, oh, I'm it's not begin. grid, is it? No. I don't know. Could somebody let us know at yeah, home? Yeah, it's not, it's not metal grid. Yeah, there is a name. Yeah, like, you know, the metal steps that you go up at concerts and all that. Not that I go to many, but, yeah. you know, that's been constructed. But yeah. anyway, oh, just let us know. Neck. Sorry, Lou. I'll be like that tonight. I've two o'clock in my head, I'll be like, <laughs> Sorry, not that she's there, I'll just fold her up. Yeah, I think she, she will. <laughs> um, right, so if you want to go for this second set, Industrial 2.0, um, so that sounds like a film, Industrial 2.0. Oh, yeah, <laughs> die hard three and a yeah. half. <laughs> uh, Twenty-four ninety-nine. That's a forty-pound saving. Five two five six two four. Then we go on to some stamps. These are snowy afternoon. Oh, these are a little bit fun and quirky, aren't they? Yeah, they are. And, and there's a couple there that you don't have to have at Christmas because that, those words ones, you could sort of almost stencil out a lot of the Christmassy ones and just have certain words that are nice. The coffee cup, you can use it all year. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, admittedly, you know, some of them are Christmas, but I, I, I the think you get like it? this. No, that isn't. No. And then the papers that you get, um, in one of the offers, it's got stuff that matches. That yarn pattern is fantastic is for the background. Oh, lovely stuff. It really is cool, yeah. Um, so, a lot of stamps on here. In yeah. fact, 25 stamps you're getting for £19.94. I know, and it's another £30 saving. This really is the big save, isn't it? Uh, 142376. Then we've got some dies. Again, mm. this is called the Snowy Afternoon Collection. These are so handy because in, yep. in here you've got things that you can cut out and it's not pr just Christmas. Those flowers, stems all year, even that um, the snowflake you can cut out into a mandala. Oh, yes. It doesn't look like it. The card, that is beautiful. Look at mm. the layers on that. That's so nice. If you did that in different colours, there's no way that looks like a poinsettia. No, at it all. could be any flower. It just could depends be. what you want. And the next Look at that beautiful yeah. side of a card, just one edge, mm. colour behind it. Yep. Oh, a few banners there as well. Absolutely. Oh, we've got letters. What does it say? Is it Merry Christmas? Yeah. Ah, yes. I see. There you go. And then we've got that last end one there. That's brilliant because that clicks into place Ooh. and then, then you have an extra die that fits on the top. Ooh. So it's like a, a card that opens. It's really clever. Great for um, gift cards. Okay. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant. Good idea. So another massive saving, £36 off. 
you're paying tw uh, 27 pounds 94 pence and it works out at 79 pence Blank. per die <laughs> 816075 oh. they're mad isn't it mad you, can't get a, you can't even get a, a bottle of water for that no corporation tar eh, pop you can but not that <laughs> Uh, right, we've got some embossing folders too, again, yes, uh, they're clever. called the snowy afternoon. What, this one's got a cutting edge as well? Yeah, they've ah. got the whole embossing plate, but inside it there's a cutting edge. You can see that actually, yeah. That doesn't mean Christmas, but it's got a great knitted background, mm -hmm. and then this one is uh, admittedly snowflake, but um, the one thing about Studio Light that I need to sort of, people sometimes say, well, what do they look like? You've got this, always got the collection and series on the back of the packet. Yeah. So if you think, well, what does that go with? If I was to say, well, you know, it's all like sort of clear, concise, and even on the dies, mm. you can see which matches which. Yeah, yeah, it's good. It's a really, so, you know, if you think you're missing one, you can look at it and see what you've got to collect. Good. See, they've thought about everything, haven't yeah, they? Yeah, yeah. So for your embossing folders, 999-843-408. Just to mention that it, everything's on delayed dispatch from the 30th of December. See, this is the thing, it's just, with Christmas week as well, everything comes to a halt, doesn't it? So it's just, but it's one of those things, but it's worth waiting for. It is, and it'll be one of them where you order it, get it, you'll be excited, and then you think, oh, what, what's this I've ordered? Yes, I forget. I love that. It is. And brilliant. then it's like, Christmas again. Yeah. This yeah. is superb. Mixed media. And I did not know this was coming back, and I haven't got this. And ah. it was just absolutely, it's one of the first ones that they brought out that I saw. It was green line, and then there was the red line. Mm. But yeah, all mixed media, but um, absolutely brilliant. They're really beautiful stamps. Those, mm. those are, you can see, you can zentangle on them, doodle. Yeah. I love them. I love the circles too, actually. They're brilliant, aren't they? Oh, and the quotations, of course. Yeah, you've got those. Love those. Um, so, what have we gone stock wise? Approaching 20% of the stock gone. Oh, we have big stock of them. Yeah, we? after just one live hour. 29.99, £35 saving. 365.332. And then, last but not least, we've got some A6 paper pads, vintagey. Yeah, you've yeah. got three different styles. Um, they're all one sided or single sided, whichever you prefer. Mm -hmm. um, you've got one that's more like. Scandi and vintage, one that's a bit quirky and then one that's really traditional. So, uh, lovely Shana has arranged these. Look how beautiful they are. I don't, we're not, we're not, don't touch them. Don't touch don't, them. Don't touch them. They told me to. No, not them. Oh, don't touch them. Oh, you're the ones that have been prettified. Yeah. Can't touch this, do. No, sorry, I can't sing. Ah. But these, you can sort of cut out little areas that you don't want. Yeah. And it's not Christmas. No, like that. Yeah, yeah. exactly. That bottom bit. Oh, no. look at that. Oh, I like that tree. I do. Close up. If you've got another page, if there's two of you, you could cut little bits out. Yeah. Decoupage or put a bird in it. Or Nice idea. Some of them are definitely Christmas, but yeah. not all of them. Not all, which is good. So you've got that paper pad. And you've got this paper pad. Oh, I like this one. Yeah. Because it's like... Because that you, I'd use that in my mixed media on year because I'd, I'd um, camouflage it. And so just so over it, it yeah, and yeah. stuff. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And it's good quality paper, oh. so it's not... That's the one thing about them, they know the papers as well. Yeah. Because that's what they've been doing for 40 years, really. Nice. There's 36 sheets per pad. Uh, so 108 sheets in total. Here's the last one. Yeah. Oh, this one's great as well. Pretty, this. Yeah, I like the colours. And I love the texture. It looks so textured. It is. And, and you could decoupage... Ooh. Uh, single bits of them because you've got two sheets yep. and you know and build them up Look. really lovely very nice indeed look at that so there we go all three of those paper pads for 12.99 252373 here's the website so you can check out everything else that we've got on the show because i'm pretty sure we've got other stuff but we just literally cannot fit it out onto the uh, the counter so do have a look on the website at hachanda.com and of course you can place your order by giving us a call as well to 01733602000 and if you've got any questions for lou if you specifically want to see something i'm pretty sure lou doesn't mind no, do we no? Like, like having a play you you can send your um, questions to studio at hachanda.com or via Facebook. And of course, if you've already got some of these items, we want to see what you've been making. Yes, yeah, we what do. you've been playing with. So I've got all sorts of stuff here to show us stuff, today. Stuff. Um, what I thought was, um, 
I'll show you some little ideas I had. When I was die cutting before, uh, one of the, the things I like to do is die cut everything and make a complete mess. Um, I love to do that. But then I've got options because then I can start to play and layer and I like to sort of think about, right, well, it, some papers that I would never normally use, well, you know, now I can sort of think, well, do I like these together? Yeah. Um, does it work? And I painted this one before, and it's a lot. It's a lot stronger now. It's been painted, so it's mm. it's strange. And then this is what I meant about doing vintage and pretty. Um, I looked at one of the papers um, in the pack, and it's got tiny bits of orange in it, just tiny bits. I'll just move it off there so you can see, just tiny bits, almost hardly orange. Mm -hmm. But then there's a little bit of paper left, so I cut out the butterfly and I left the cog out at the end of the week. It look, I know it looks a bit moth but I, I really like yeah, that. Yeah. And then the papers, so these are all the like little papers that I'd stamped on and done and then here's another one. So basically we're using all these and we've got a, a totally mm -hmm. vintage feel to Absolutely. it. It's not, not grunge. But then I thought what I could do is I really like this idea of layering this into a flower. Okay. Oh, yeah. And I thought each one, because it is d really delicate, and I've I've made sure that, you know, some are cut out really well and some less. I wasn't worried about that, because I can see where to cut. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you've got different, you can like, three-dimensional. So I thought well, we'd try that, and then all oh, these bits, these are bits that I've cut off. I mean, some of, some of these I didn't mean to... Um, um, what is it, die cut, they mm -hmm. just happen to be stuck on the end, so... Oh, right. I but I just want to show you, first thing I'm going to do, really, is get a little bit of colour on this buff card. Um, I've got this really nice sort of buff card that'll be a ba the backdrop for my work, but I want to, to to make it more in keeping with this. So yeah. the first thing I'm going to do is get uh, the titanium white, you can use gesso, mm -hmm. and I'm just going to put a line of that out. Now, I've already got colour on my mat, and I don't really, I'm not not worried about that. I've got colour on my, um, my right. yeah, my roller, so I'm not really worried that there's a little bit, if you've got big chunks missing like that, just go in a tiny bit. Now, when you are printing, you'll get what we call a tack, and you can just hear it, go near it. <laughs> you can hear it sticking, yeah. and that means it's ready, but you've only got a very short window, so, and then you just, see, it's t even now, so what you do when you get to that, just tiny bit of water, yeah. reactivate it, and just bring on no, even more. It's because it's so warm. Right, here we go. So I'm just taking the edge off there. Mm -hmm. It looks like hardly anything's on it, but it, you're better off building layers. Oh, it's nice because it already looks a bit vintagey. Yeah, exactly. If yeah. you start to just, you know, slap a load of white on, yeah. it goes too much. Now I'll add a little bit of that white. I'll add a tiny bit of water to it now and now this time I'm going to put a tiny bit of the teal Ooh, only lovely. a tiny bit and this is why <laughs> <laughs> and th that's still my first tube and I'm thinking this mixed with that I'll yep. get that nice colour nice nice so and then again strain quickly look look at those colours nice together and I'm going to leave it unmixed okay Oh, yes. So I've got like a, a minty, tealy colour. These colours top. always remind me of like a peeling paint. Oh, absolutely. Of a it's a, the old French vin yes. vintage sort of thing where you've got, um, what are they called, like wardrobes and things that yes. have been stood there for years and painted. There's a lot of European um, people when they go on holiday mm -hmm. around Europe and different sort of places and they just take pictures of peeling paint and, yeah. look, and I really appreciate it. I do. Yeah. I'm, I don't think it's odd. I don't. I like it. And, and I see people and they're like, why have you got uh, all these on it? But it's because it's so appealing. And you can see... Appealing. Uh, oh, boom, boom, boom. I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> can you see how the colour, very stark at the beginning and yep. bright, it's just sinking in and that's what I want. Lovely. Now I'm going to pick up another colour and there's a slight orange in there, so I'm going to go to my Quinacridone. Mm -hmm. Now... No, that's not the one. <laughs> this is the one. Quinacridone. Right. This is quinacridone azo nickel gold. For want of a better word, it's like a, a rust in a bottle. Now you need very little because this is a fluid paint. Ah. Uh, so. Oh yes. And you just pick in. 
I'm warming this up really. Rest in a bottle. Yeah, cool. it is. Now all those colours, you've got orange, you've got white, you've got teal, and they're still now. If I bring these in, you can see how these are starting to... Yeah, that works with the background now. It really, really mm. works. So don't forget, you know, just take your layers really, really gently because it, you can't take it off. I'm personally thinking it needs some more white, only because okay. it looks like it's... Um, sinking in quite fast. You'll find that with your card. Your card isn't stop it? Re reacts differently. Some is really absorbent, oh. others isn't. Now look at that, the way it's like, what's the word, it's grainy. I like that. Yeah, and when you go to stamp or anything on top of this, mm -hmm. the grain or like, great word that, it actually, um, lovely. you can pick it up with wet, um, embossing wax and everything. Mm -hmm. It's really, now this is quite strong, so you'd only pick up Tiny bit. Okay. Um, now the industrial 2.0 is approaching. Oh, really? 60% of the stock gone. Right. There's 40 pounds off. It's 24.99. 525.624. Lovely. Right. I've just got a bit mad there. So if you've got a bit mad, don't worry because we're going to stamp on this. Okay. So I've got my base colour. I'll Love get it. this here. And again, I'm happy with that because I've got some contrast going on. So then I'm going to get my stamps. Now, this is where you start to think, nah, this is not going to work. This will not work, but... Oh, I like the stamp. Yeah, exactly. This is... Mm. It, it's just so not what you think. Right, these... We only was using it on a, you know, on a, a block and yeah. then off a block. So you can use it either way. I'm just going to use them later. I'll get them out of the way, actually, mm -hmm. so you can see. So, oh, oh. Thank you, thank you. We've had an email about the name of that, you know, the stamp that, this yeah. one, this one, what's yeah. it called? Right, thank you. Apparently it's called Diamond Plate. Oh, I didn't know that. That's it. No, I knew it had a name. Thank you so much. Who was, who was that from? Dylan, thank you so much, Dylan, because that was going to drive us potty. You <laughs> have saved us all now from tonight. From sleepless nights. Yes, thank you, you. have, because we'd all be there going, oh. Well, I didn't even know it was called that. I just <laughs> thought it was called corrugated metal. Right. <laughs> Again, I did this in the last one, is putting the paint that I've used onto the stamp because you might not have the right colour um, embossing ink. Uh, inks. Yes. Do, do you have to get this off quite quick, though? Yeah, you do. Um, but because I'm putting it on quite water, you know, thinly, yeah. I've got a little bit more time than normal. But you still do look square, and this is, again, layers. But this is where it takes on different, different looks. Oh. That is cool. You don't, it doesn't look anything like you think. No, and it doesn't look like the stamp. It just looks really cool now, though. All those layers. Just going to put on that way as well. So now we get a grain and a texture. I'll add a little bit more. And I think, you know, this is, it's worth taking your time with the layers because you do get an amazing effect. Absolutely. And you can afford to sort of darken this up as you go. Mm -hmm. So as I'm building this colour up now, there's a bit of blue there and it, and I can add blue over the top and I'll start to get a little bit of depth in it. So I've gone that way. I'll go over the top and just show you what I mean. This is, we only did this before, not me. Oh, nice. That is good. Now, that is really quite industrial, but it's not grungy. Mm -hmm. and, um, it's more, it's like you're mixing shabby chic. Absolutely. Yeah. Perfect. You're right there. Oh, speaking of grunge, got a grunge collection on the show. Oh, yeah. That's Do we get all of these? Oh, amazing. excellent. All four. So we've got this one. It's one of my favourites. So. Yeah, look at this. Big saving again for this uh, collection. Ah, oh, look at that. That's brilliant that as is well. Per that is brilliant. Mm. It really is good, that. Now, we're approaching 30% of the stock gone. They're really useful as well. And it's also got a freedom price, 17 99 You're getting all of those. £22 saving, 607045. You wouldn't believe that um, you could get metal cut out with those dies, but you can. You can cut out metal with them. And you think because they're quite thin that they're not going to cut out metal, but they do. Right. So, I've, I've gone like cross-hatching. And again, and as you add the colours, they'll start to mix the cells. So, you know, this is basically yellow and green, uh, yellow and blue, and we're going to get green. And I'm getting some nice watercolours mm. now. So you see how that now has come full circle from yeah. 
Right. So that's that one stamp. Now, as you said, the best bit to do is just pellet plenty of water on it and then you can go when you finish you yeah. can just wipe it off. Okay. So I'm going to get this textural stamp now. I think this is in the add-on. Um, not what, the add -on. Oh, you mean at the end of call? No, the, um, oh, the next one. Sorry, is it 2.0? Yeah, 2.0. No, it's three. This actually, I'm wrong. Sorry. Oh, it's three. It's so three. This is the th the it's that one that's two, isn't it? The gears. Right. Sorry, my fault. So which one's this two? Three. This is number three. Sorry. So this is in it. Now these are all these patterns, and um, although they are quite, what you'd say quite, they could be like metal, mm -hmm. like little what they call rivets. Yeah. Um, you can actually just there's not much on there, so I'll use um, an ink pad instead. Oh. Oh, Don't forget to get all your sprays out and stuff. Oh, they're nice. Mm -hmm. Might be a little bit too much, but I, I don't want to change the colour, so this is where you've got to make the choice. If you've got the colour ink yeah. to match, then use that. But if you haven't, just go back in with your paint. Okay. Now, I did have a really nice embossing thing, but as always, I tidied up. I hate it when I tidy up. I absolutely hate <laughs> it. Look. What are you looking for? My, my block. Don't your, worry. Uh, I'll use this. That. That's the one. Thanks. <laughs> but I hate it. Why do I bother tidying you know, up? This is why, Mark, because I don't like it. If if I tidy up, I can't find anything. Right. When you're using paint, though, spread it out. You're creating your own sort of um, ink pad. So just a little bit. And now we're going to go, just going to create like little patterns. Now. If you sort of keep them into groups of three, yeah. they won't be overpowering. And then across again. Mm -hmm. So I'm loving how this is. All these layers are fabulous. I'm just, you know, trying to show people that although this is grunge, it doesn't have to be sort of heavy grunge. It can be, you know, as nice as you want. Now, you can make this into anything. I'm going to make it into sort of like a journal cover if yeah. I wanted to. So that's that one. That's quite pretty. So we've used two or three stamps now. I could even go in with the diamond plate. Ooh. Now just, we know what it is called. Yeah, now we know what it's called. And just bring this out again. And just, you don't need a lot because this is, this paint I'm using is an open paint. Uh, sorry, it's... A heavy body, so you get lots. Oh yes, of um, registration on this, and it's opaque. So I th I'm thinking that's enough. But again, you must put water on it. Yes. So I'm happy with that. I'm going to leave that to dry, and then I'm going to get some of my bits. So I thought I really liked the uh, butterflies, how they all sort of come together. So I've got these colours, the greens. And I've got the, um, mm -hmm, there they are. I'm going to make a choice now of which do I want. I'll tell you what, I might change that actually. I'm going to choose an area. If you think this was a piece of buff card mm. and it's suddenly it's taken on a whole new um, lease of life. Yeah, absolutely. Now, what you could do is leave it like that, but I quite, I'm quite liking that area. Okay. And I'm quite liking that area there. So what I might do... Oh, she says. If you've got... I want to try and rip it. Now, if you've got one of these, these are great. Oh, yeah. you can rip your edges. So choose the area you want. I'm just going to nip over here, and okay. you can get a dark colour. No, I think I will get this colour. And this is like a really... I would never use this normally. It's not a colour that I would have thought, oh, no, it's a bit bright. Right. But when... I'll just show you now what I mean. That does work. Absolutely. It's it amazing, does. that, isn't yeah. it? You, you think, no, that's awful, but... So instead of doing that, I'm going to think now it would make a really nice card. Mm -hmm. So quite like that. Oh, no, I like that bit there. <laughs> so I'm just going to make it into a square. You can do whatever you want with yours, obviously. That's not square. It doesn't have to be. But rip, rip as much as you can and then do these pages. And okay. I'm just going to put that on there. But I don't like that edge. It, it's not the same. OK. It, so all I'm doing, you can use um, a, ra a, a shaver to do this, you know. But be careful, obviously. Oh, yeah, yeah, like um, a, a face one, a man's face one. Yeah. Uh, 
or your knife. You can use anything, whatever you're scissors, to do maybe? it. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. scissors are fine, yeah. I mean, this is made to do it. And, and just do it a bit at a time and try both directions. And what you can do is make it curl as well. But I just want enough roughage, oh, I love that word, roughage, roughage on the edge so that it'll accept more paint and it'll look darker. But what I will do is keep that edge clean and straight knife. So I'm just going to get, so you get your, I want it to go darker. Now this is a choice to make, do I mm -hmm. want to go really dark? So I've got a little bit of the dark blue there, I'm going to mix it with this mm -hmm. and I'm just going to wedge this now to see if I can get this Oh yeah, that shadow. works. See the dark That's blue nice. now has just picked it up. So what you could do is try um, colours on the other side of your paper. You've got two two areas of paper. Yeah. I bring that in again and I'll show you the difference now once that hits that orange again. And this picks up the orange from the quinacridone. So it all fits. Now if I put that back, that completely pops. Mm, I love that. And it's cool. You, you think really, you think, oh goodness me, those colours are a bit but they're actually once you put them together it's quite surprising, isn't it? Now when I wouldn't do this, I'd have a paper cutter at home, but I'm not too worried about this. So as Be long careful. as I treat it, keep it straight, and I'll just go straight down. And then... Look how straight that is. Come on, Lou. Okay, brilliant. <laughs> Look at that. Um, so has there been another email? Oh, lovely. Oh, hello. Okay. Hello. So it's about the diamond plate again. Oh, oh, yeah. I love facts. I love it. I do, I do. So, also called Durbar plates. Durbar. Mm. It's been on the um, googie eye thing. Yeah. And, and what else, Sandro? A tread plate. Tread plate. That's it. Tread plate. Yeah, that's that's the one. Yeah, and diamond plate. Yeah, tread, tread plate. plate. Um, thank you so much. Who's that from? You get a gold star. Oh, Jay. Just Jay, Jay. you, get, you get a gold star. Well yeah. done, you. Top at class. <laughs> Oh, I've got a bit. Uh, That's it. it. Brilliant. Thanks, guys. Everybody at home. Thank you. So I'm going to make this could be a front for a card. It could be a front for your journal. It could be anything. Mm. Just showing you the use of all the layers. And I'm into my layers now. That does not look right. So let me do it again. I'm into my layers. I'm into um, changing up stuff. Yeah. Right. So now I've got this wonderful die cut. Lovely. And I've got to make the choice. Do I want the die cut on it? Do you? Or do I want... <laughs> See, you've got these. Now, you see, if I put these on, it'll show you that it's too much now. Mm -hmm. But you can actually over... But it's still, y your eye goes. So what I want to do is bring a little bit more definition to this. So yep. this is cut out of paper that's very similar. So I'll go back to this, but this time... Where is it? Come on with us. Um, this is a darker one. OK. And I'm going to use that blue, and it looks like there's nothing there, but it's for some reason you can get a, what we call a second shadow out of this colour. Don't, excuse me, oh, what? a second shadow. If you look, ah. it's it's actually not paint dry. It's dry, but it does colour. Oh, all right. And I'll show you what I mean. It just colours it enough. Just darkens a little bit. And you think, oh, nothing's going on, but it actually is. If I move this away, you'll see now. I've just darkened the edge, and the reason I did that is because the last demo I did, I noticed that I, it, it, it did need this darker colour to right. bring it out. So I'll just show you now. Don't be too heavy-handed, because it is, this is paper after all, but I'll show you now how it's brought that out. Yeah. So we've got this. I'll bring that down. So I've got that. And then I've got the flower... The, these so I've cut these out these are on the one day special I'm lovely just bringing in a little bit of blue there have you seen what Shana's doing I don't know what she's doing I think she's cleaning wheels isn't it that's like cleaning the uh that don't don't show me don't want to know she's on the floor cleaning the fluff out there the, the fluff out. out of the wheels of the cameras you don't like your evil when you've got to get your knife on it and clear up <laughs> yeah or oh, airs off it Oh, whatever. It might not be airs, but in my case it is. Yeah. <laughs> so I've just got a little bit of orange, um, the quinacridone, and I've just added a little bit to it just to give that... Nice. Oh, I like that. And then we can make a choice whether we want to keep grungy or... We can do anything. You can have two. But I do like this. Mm -hmm. Or what you can do is slit that in half and, and make it even... 
But I like that, you see. Now, choices, choices. Yeah, and I'll show you with the orange. You could do that, you could, but I think... Mm, oh, decoupage in the mud. Yeah, mm. I was thinking what you could do is just cut areas out mm. and have a three-dimensional butterfly. But I actually like this one. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is really simple, really, really simple. I'm going to get um, a tiny bit of the, the blue mm. and I'm just going to put it here with this teal and I'm going to get a brush and it's similar to what I did before I'm just going Ooh. to create my own colour with the teal. Gosh there's a lot that comes out of that um, uh, that one spl splodge not splodge. This is why I try, I try and say to people you know this paint is amazing coverage it's you can well you go a long way yeah, to sort of find one that's any well, it comes near it. They've been doing it for years, so mm. they know. So you can rub some of the areas and get the get the patterns coming up. Are you all sorted for Christmas? I don't really celebrate it, but yeah, I uh, no, yeah. it's there's only me and the other half now. Yeah. So it gets a bit. If I had kids, it'd be different. Oh. I'd be. Right, I've got this splat, and this splat goes with the splats on there. Right, and I'm just going to put a little bit on there now you don't have to I could put dots I could put the lines I could put anything wavy on it but I'm just trying to marry it between the two so and this is just finishing off now but these are the sort of demos that people have said to me they really like yeah absolutely because they're using everything in it but they're getting lots of ideas and, and satisfaction yes and when you see this stamped it's quite surprising how nice it actually looks look at that I really like that yeah it looks really different and I'll put white on in a minute now and I'm just going to add just so that because we've got this layer we've got that layer there and we've got this one here and I need to bring that into there so very lightly just mm. a tiny bit and maybe and remember it's stirred so if I've got one there I'll put one down here and don't be frightened of using this as well and the same I'll swap it over I'll bring the teal in now and I might put a tiny bit of teal I'm not putting it on the background there I'm putting it on that so it brings a sandwich I think it's falling off the block Oh, oh there you go. a bit like me, falling <laughs> off a block. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, come on. This is Leone, this, with the embossing powder. <laughs> what, we're blaming Leone? Yeah, she's like not it. here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but she's not well. She's not well. Is she not? No, nah, she went off. Oh, she went a bit, oh, crying out loud. Right. Oh, sack it. Right. <laughs> right. A few dots on it. Not a lot. You're not supposed to do it like this, but you can. And if you've got your pearls... Get your pearls on and your little, and then the last bit I'm going to do, so, and then I'll build it up and show you is, I'm going to do that, but in white, and you'll see it'll go pop. Well, not literally, but. Yeah? Oh, what? nothing, nothing. I don't worry. like, yeah, what? You're all right. Right, so if this is the, the blob. I know there's not, that's not the proper name, but this is what it looks like to me, like the big blob. Yeah, and I'm I just like the word blob. There Ooh. we go. I'm not going to put too much on now, just the top there and a tiny bit there. And I'm just going to bring that in there and bring a tiny bit of the white into the background so yeah. that it doesn't look. And then thirds. Yep, two thirds. And then I'd build it up. Now, this is where you can. You can bring in your colours now, I think. Oh, quite like that behind. It looks quite mm. nice. Now, you can have it. What might be nice, actually, what might be really nice... What? Might be nice if I just chop... See here, you've got a natural line. Yeah. So I'm going to chop that off so that we'll be able to see the, ah, the background. Got you. Um, because what, what we, I don't know if you do this, when you get your dyes, we tend to just see them as they are. Uh, uh, yeah, and I'm a culprit for that. So I need to do more of what you're doing here. It's, well, I have to, and this is what I thought. I thought, and it's only because I saw the man's that Dala shape, and I thought, oh, there's a flower in there. Mm. And you can choose, because I can see there's a flower leaf there, but then there's also this one that's going round. So it's almost, we used to do this years ago with the decoupage, where you'd pick your own areas. But don't forget, you could do it with all of these. Yeah. Right, so to bring it that 
Sorry, you watching me cut out must be so boring. But you can keep these, these little bits here. Oh, they're awesome. You know, you know, you can put them in there. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know, and nice. do that. Or you could turn them over even and use the white side. Mm -hmm. But it's a bit brash, that. So, tiny bit of glue, not a lot. I'm only just going to put it in the middle because I'm not standing here doing that for ages. I'm going to put the petal there at the top, more or less. Yeah. And then I'm going to put this. Now, what you can do... Yes, that works really well. If you shadow it or just put it off, you can put it straight on the top so you've got a layer. Or you can just offset it. I prefer it straight on the top. Okay. And then it, you only need it here, really, because that... You see, you can do it offset like that as well, which is mm. where it goes in between. I quite like it like that, though. And then do that. And then you could get another one in the middle if you wanted. Yeah. And um, so now what I need is, I need to think, would I put an orange one there or just go straight for that? I actually quite like it just like that. Mm -hmm. And then I would. But just the thing that you need to do, just, this is me being a bit sad. A bit it's what? A bit sad. Why? Well, this here annoys me because it's white and it's overpowering so what i would do is just get a little tiny bit of this okay. and, and splash a bit um i'm just going to flip through these yeah please do papers uh so these are your a4 that we've got on the show you're getting four a4 they are double-sided look are oh, they really pretty aren't they yeah they're lovely these are nice or well, one of mine might have gone walkabout possibly there you go oh i've not got it don't blame me no i won't We'll, we'll blame you, <laughs> There you go. Oh, I realise that's upside down. Anyway, you will get four. It might be here, and I've just hidden it. And then you've got... Oh, it is. It is. Here it is. It's me. Look, that's like a knit. That's really it interesting. Is. Well, it goes with the stamp. Ah, of course. The knitting stamp. So, so that's, that's what I mean about them all working together. Mm -hmm. They do really well, don't they? And then you've got your um, 12 by 12s. Double-sided, of course. These are lovely. Oh, ice skates. Nice. You've got your um, like wood grain there. This one. And then we've got this one. This is upside down again, I think. Let's turn this around. The bubble gob. There it is. You're right, lovely. I'm oh. nearly there. No, no, I'm just. Yeah. Away with yourself. fairies, me. Yeah, mm -hmm. just getting on with a clone. So. Yeah. Uh, Nine ninety nine for your uh, A4 and your twelve by twelve papers. Eight two six one two two. What I've done is, I've got the, the yellow, or a yellow, I've got the orange one, but you can just see the embossing on it. Now, at home, you'd, be em you'd emboss this a little bit more. Um, and I'm just taking, I don't want it to change colour, I just want it to take that edge off. So, I've put a tiny bit of glue in the middle, yeah. and I've just put that there, in the middle. And then, what I've done here is, I've coloured underneath it, because... Lovely. It's just it too brash. Really, yeah. yeah, it would. And then what I would do is just wiggle that a bit. And I've got a tiny bit of orange wire, and I would put the oh yeah, you know, put the them like that. And not the stamens, the um, antennae. Yeah, and and I just I'm just going to lift, but then so you're almost just seeing the. This looks so funky. Right. I love it. But if you've got these little bits here, just pull off. That's the bit because they're almost like perforated and you could almost build these up with in the corners into your three-dimensional bits like that. I really like them. Mm, I'm, I'm putting them on. <laughs> there. And you would get, you know, like the brads or... And, so these are the extra bits that I've just ripped off. But yep. just shows you that you can even put one there, but I'm defeated. No, three. So I've got one there, one there. And where would you put one, Alex, now? I read it. Oh, that looks lovely. That's what so I'm saying. It's great. Right. I've got a dilemma here because I've gone diagonal. So it's either there or there or there. I, th I think I like up there. Yeah, I do. And what you could do is if you've got a bigger one like that, you could have it sort of sticking out. But the, the thing is, if you've got a white pen, mm. if you've got anything like that, then don't forget, I think I've got it's one It's a here. staple, actually, I think. We all Absolutely. need one of these. And I mean, this is, I don't know if this is a fine white one. Sometimes you need to sort of let it get going, give it a little bit of welly first. Yes. Yeah. It, 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 well, it's gone to sleep. Yeah. So that has gone to sleep. I'd leave it like that for now, but I've got another one now. I've got a Posca. So what you could do is just add. I loan these out to people and they get them back and they're right. Oh, look at that. What 
put on my bike. Ooh, I like that one as well. <laughs> <laughs> we can put that on there like that. There you could. Right, so what I would do is then I would just sort of try and I would decorate so I might put some little like stitching lines round it and then round the edge of this here because I think it's lost its edge a little bit. So just by... That looks effective, yeah. Yeah, and if you leave a line as it is, it can be a bit obtrusive, so if you just rub it in a little bit, it doesn't look as heavy. But you're bringing back the outline, which is what you want, because it's sort of lost it now. And anything that you've got here that you want highlighting, um, white pen's fabulous mm. for. If you want to just sort of, you know, bring in, like, backgrounds there mm. don't do it all over because you're not trying to make a pattern well you can do it's t entirely up to you but i'm just saying that these are some of the little patterns you can use I remember when you were stitching at school you could do your um blanket stitch mm. and do different styles of stitching if it works don't put paint on it with us oh what have i done now look at that Right, pretend you didn't see that. Okay. Right, that looks rubbish there. But you would, you do sort of stitching on there. Now, I'm quite happy with that. I would faff cool, that. for ages. But considering we've got bright orange and teal, we've got the die cuts, we've done all the layers and we've mm. made all the papers ourselves. Nice. And I've used the whole one day special. And I don't often like my work, but I like that. Yeah, it's fantastic. Mm, we're going to do a quick recap because we want to play some more. Is that yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, of course it is. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. Here is the website, so you can see there's lots more items that we've got on the show that we can't possibly fit on the counter. So please have a look online. There are those papers again. They're fabulous. You've got your mixed media collection as well. Your wonderful vintage Christmas collection papers. Loads of stamps. So we haven't got these out, and there's some dies too. Oh look! Ooh, romantic botanic dies. Oh, I haven't seen those. Winter feelings. Lovely stuff. Right, so your one day special, it's called Industrial 3.0. And you've got 24 stamps and 21 dies in total. So we'll just have a little peruse um, right. along the top here. So we've got some cogs and wheels. Then you've got that lovely butterfly. Got the arrow, great for your journal pages. And then I love the cogs with the arrows. That's probably one of my favourites. And then you've got the camera or the film, what's it? It's amazing. That's a really good one. You could put like your own words in that. Yeah. Do your own journal in it. See, like that. Yeah. Nice idea. Mm -hmm. And then we've got stamps along the bottom. So these are your workers. You've got the light bulb and the camera. And then this is a fantastic background stamp. And the next one. I love that. The sort of dribbles dripping down. And then you've got uh, some of your, what do they call the old fashioned... Um, Oh, I can't think of it. Like when you're traveling, when you're traveling and you collect th things. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Thank you. <laughs> uh, right, so that is uh, 49 99 a massive saving of £46. Two payments of £25 if you want to spread the cost on Flexibuy. Uh, 767482 is your item number. Now, the um, is it the prequel? The prequel to Industrial 3.0 is industrial 2.0 which is this one here and we've got the tread plate the diamond plate awesome we know the name of it I'm really grateful for your emailing in um, so you've got that it's again a great background it's going to create and then we've also got the cogs but it's a clock as well fabulous liking that idea these are again great worker dies and then if we go down to the bottom we've got these like hanging on chains light bulb um, and then you've got the screws and the bolts and then the train with the tracks and the suitcases. Awesome. £40 saving. It's £24.99. 525624. Now let's have a look at this romantic botanic. I've not seen this. Let's have a look. So you've got, you've got six dyes in total. No, I've not got this. Have you not? What would we use these for, Lou? These what are great for layering and, and, and your journal pages are on front of cards. I mean, you could even fold that over and make that a three-dimensional card. I can oh. see that. You know, like the edges. Nice. Why well, haven't I got these? I, I do not know. This is terrible. Complain to management. I am. <laughs> complaining. <laughs> complaining. They're sixteen ninety nine. Lovely. Right. Well, before, on... Um, 
do, gonna do a Facebook Live and I did two lessons as well. Well, lessons, sorry, you know, show things. And I did <laughs> I showed you how to change up papers, very similar to what we was doing. Yeah. Um, and it was it wasn't that I didn't like the paper, it was just that the paper had got messed up. Okay. Because it had been and I'd cleaned up with it. <laughs> so I was thinking, well, what do we do? But I like these strong colours. I like the idea of making all these again into really pretty but flowers using the cogs and i just think and this is fantastic mm. look at that i mean you can build all these up you know if you oh those colors work really well absolutely yeah. but you know you can take the edge off and you can build it up any way you want so um i just love the idea of playing with that and it'd work on here as well you know mm. so i was just thinking i really like the flowers and then you've got this nameplate, which is, that's fantastic, because you just put a tiny slip of uh, paper, I'll show you in a minute, and just with the name on yeah. it, and it looks brilliant. I've got like a little envelope of dead. I mean, how cool would that be there? Mm. Oh, like a nameplate on nice. there. It just looks really cool, doesn't Very it? Very effective, yeah. And, and these are papers, these are all waste papers, honestly. They're, they're not something that I would normally use, mm -hmm. but I just like the idea of making sure that it's all used yeah i can't stand leaving stuff um wasting it now what's going on in the world we need to make sure that we've got rid of everything in the right way mm. and use it so what i did was got this paper and um changed it up and then we've got these stamps which are on the show and these are great because they've got almost this old vintagey like i don't even know what it says hang on premium goods Right, where are these? Oh, those were the ones we see. Aren't they in two? Yeah. 2.0, yeah. I think so. No, three. Oh, I keep getting them wrong. They're in Sorry. three, and they're A6 stamps, but I just wanted to show you on the back how the orange and the green is a great Ooh. colour. What's the... Is it a word beginning with... You know, when you... Oh, what, oh, why am I having trouble with words? When you've got your greens and your rust colours and they all come together, p -p -p patina. Patina. Oh right, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what that yeah a patina is when you you've got an age to a, a stamp, right? Uh, like an age to a metal or a surface. Yes, yeah. thank yeah. you. That's so lovely. what to do that, which is really nice to do. I'll show you on here. We've got this big stamp, and you get um, a little bit of. Say you've got this a yellow or an orange okay. and I've got my quinacridone so I'll show you with that if you haven't got that and you want to make one at home and you've got this ochre if you get an ochre colour and then a tiny bit of glue you don't want to see what's going on down I'm there I'm sorry I literally was like Whoa. it's not nice it's like <laughs> pulling out minging bits off your rollers I wish we could get a shot of Shana can you get that look at her can you see her? Look at her on the floor. Look at that. <laughs> She's trying to clean all the air off it. Oh! Right. Anyway, what I've done here is I'm go going to create my own transparent layer. Right. So you can make your own paint um, transparent, whereas normally this is opaque, so you'd see nothing underneath it. But by mixing the glue, I've got... Look at this. It's, it's <laughs> everywhere. There's hair in it. <laughs> we blame Shana. Yeah. We're flicking it all over, love. <laughs> You're flicking it over. She's like that with a screwdriver and it's landing in here. <laughs> right, so can you see now, it's not the same colour, but I've now made a transparency just by nice. using glue. Yeah. So don't forget to use your glue. And then what I'm going to just quickly show you, but with it being glue... Wash it off. You've got to. Yeah. Because it, it's meant to dry and stick. But it's great because... I'll show you what I mean now. Little trick. If we do this, and then I'll do it on here... Oh, yeah, that's cool. You can do a couple over there. Yeah. Give it a... And if you haven't got time to wash it, just put a little bit of that on. And then I'm going to use this, and I'm going to put a tiny bit of the black with it. And now I'm using blue, so I'm going to get green. So okay. I don't want that, so oh, I would right. use black. Okay. I want to age this. I don't want to make it go green. If I added the blue... I'll show you what I mean. If I add the blue to it, I'll get a green look. Yeah, yeah, you do. So I don't, I want it shaded. So you'll see I don't get a, I don't get a blue. Mm -hmm. I'll get a shade. Yeah. Right, so I'll get the same, a different stamp. I'd do this all over, actually. I wouldn't just do it on one. I'd, I'd go all over with it and stamp on and off. 
Mark. Oh, uh, we're twenty percent gone of the one day special and we had a deep stop stock, I should say. Two payments of twenty five pounds. That's a massive forty six pounds saving. Seven six seven four eight two. Wow, that is good. That is really good. So I've got here the one of the round ones now and I'm just intermittent. So this is an old page of views and I'm gonna make it look like an old well try to make it look like an old um like postcard almost. Yeah. So as that stands now, that's still I can still put my embossing powder on that. So Ooh, yay. I could do a number of colours. I could do white, I could do a dark blue, I could do gold. I could do any colour and sometimes these colours look quite nice. Nice. So you could use any colour you want. But the colour I'm looking for You can't is, find it. It's here somewhere and it's clear. Yanis was helping me before. Oh, Yanis. Hey, I'm blaming Yan Yanis now. Yanis, who's that? Right, don't matter. And well, here we go. Have we you found it? No, the egg mm. with mm. us. Where? Oh, I've got it. It's in drawer. Oh. Right, some of it hasn't stuck and some of it has. But because I've got glue in the paint, hopefully the glue is still a bit active. So when I put this on, it'll stick. Lovely. And what it'll do is it should intensify the colour. It should. It's stuck some places, not everywhere, because it was. I was too messing about. Ooh, too messing about. Yeah, mm -hmm. too messing about. Is that even? It that, is now. It's loud. Is that even right? <laughs> no. Right. So a quick embossing with this just shows you how. Hopefully, fingers crossed. I'm saying all this. It should bring the colours out. I can see some up there. I think it's not. It's stuck. Yeah. Hopefully, it should bring out some of the colours a bit brighter. Oh, there you go. Yeah, it is working. Oh, lovely. Yeah, yeah. You can see that now. And I'm saying to Yanis that people just automatically think you've got to use an embossing ink. You don't. Have... No, I've learned that from you. I had no idea. I didn't think about it. Yeah, you don't need it. As long as it's wet, you can use anything. Water, you can use it, but that can brush off. But glue, anything. I mean, the beauty of this is you can keep that going with it. Mm. I love watching that turn. I magic. do. Never get fed up of that. No. Never, never, never get fed up of that. I was being asked the, um, not so long ago, what's my favourite ink? And I said, I couldn't tell you because I hardly use it because I, I love to emboss so yeah, much. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And this is it. You find out what you really enjoy doing. And mm. sometimes, though, we need to break out of our little comfort zone yeah. and do something because it's easy to just isn't it just, yes just stay in that stay in your style stay in that now i've got a tiny bit of, i've got a new one i'm breaking out got a new one I've, I've got the die cut the butterfly so you can use anything oh, you good. want yeah you could use a die cut that you've got of the cogs if you want anything you want mm -hmm. um and i'm just going to put a really light shadow on it again i might need water it's drying very fast it is, isn't it yeah and I, I just i don't want it to be really obvious i just want like a little shadow yeah i need it a bit more than that but it will go into the card the background card that's not had any paint on it if you see what i mean it'll go yeah. darker in areas might need a little bit more lovely nice and and this is getting that um how can i put it there's a color in here that i really like this color and it's getting this back. Yeah. This green. Yeah. So, and again, and then swap it out for something else. So let's go for, we've got all this. This is a nice one that I did before. And this again, all on here. So you're building up layers again, and this is an old paper, but you're using it. These are stencils, mm -hmm. these. But I'm just going to change it up a little bit and use this grid one. And what I would do, have we got time? I doubt it. We've what, got a minute and a half. No, I haven't got time. I would get an ink on this one and just stamp in black, but I would get the words double it. Are you on the plastic? Oh, I thought for a sec. Oh, it's because it, I'm sorry. So sorry, it's, Lou. No, no, it's all right. It's just a bit bigger than yeah. I think. What um, I would do is just do this twice and cut the words out. Right, it's fallen off anyway. Just. <laughs> Slum it down. <laughs> um, oh yeah, that's good. 
not too much no but that's made it all pop now i know it's very similar to what i've just done but i started with different things started with different colors so yeah. to speak and you get a really nice effect with the stamps because you can get a full stamp or you can get an edge yeah. and a bit or you want that bit there if i wanted the word gear maybe not maybe <laughs> gear what's that one down down up and down i love up and down that's me up and down <laughs> Right, so just put me up. Oh, where oh, there's another one. Up, and then we we'll go down. So the stamps that we've got here, just yeah. to show you, that stamp, that one there, yeah. all match with ooh, these fifteen seconds. Right, these all match together. Can you see those yeah. hexagons going up? So brilliant. Oh, thank you, Lou. Thank Always you so a joy. Much. Boom. Thank you. Uh, thank you as well, and we'll be right back after this break. Coming up next, oh, add some sparkle, I love those kits, uh, followed by the repeat of this show, and then we've got Joanna Sheen magazine launch, lovely jubbly, have a good evening everyone. Hi everyone, I'm Phil Martin. I've been paper crafting for over 20 years now. You could say it's a passion of mine. Uh, Sentimentally Yours is my award-winning brand of craft products. I design stamps, paper pads, uh, tools, embellishments, all the things that we need to help us enjoy our crafting. My aim with Sentimentally Yours is to bring unique, top quality, innovative designs for every level of crafter. So whether you are a beginner or whether you are more experienced, there will be something for you. On my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ochanda, I will be doing my best to teach and educate you on how to get the most from the products, but always with a laugh and a giggle. Make sure you join me and tune in for my Sentimentally Yours shows on Ochanda. Hi there, I'm Nick from Craftscope. I've been crafting for as long as I can remember. Uh, it started off making things just for myself, but then friends and family asked for, if they could use them too. It was really important to me to bring something unique to the crafting arena, something that was different and something that people would enjoy using just as much as I do. I really hope you'll come and join me on Hachanda for my shows with Craftscope. Hi, I'm Leslie from Chocolate Baroque and we design and manufacture our own rubber stamps right here in the northeast of England. We have a wonderful in-house designer called Sue who hand draws all the images which we then transfer into rubber stamps. We have very, very elaborate designs. We have everything from steampunk right through to beautiful florals and then we have scenic and we have words. Our stamps are beautifully elaborate, very, very detailed, exquisitely etched, and the quality is next to none. So good that if you look after your stamps, we guarantee them for a lifetime. Whether it's stamping, mixed media, or art journaling, join us at Hajanda for our journey into everything creative and messy, and see what you can create with our stamps. Perfect time of the year to add some sparkle. That's what we're doing right now. I've got a big cheer from the gallery, Rob, for getting that right as Wonderful. well. Because thank you. It could have been add more sparkle, add lots of sparkle. We could change it to suit. There's no problem. Well, no. Listen, listen. You're chopping along nicely. Don't change for me. Anyway, it's great to meet you. you do um, and I know how popular your projects are, and I see you on your promo all of the time as well. For those people who haven't yet encountered you, give us a potted history of Add Some Sparkle. Add Some Sparkle. We've been around, we're a little around about 10 years now as a business. Okay. Um, we started selling just embellishments. Mm -hmm. And then my wife Jackie's been doing paper embroidery for years. Mm -hmm. She said, why don't we do a paper embroidery kit? Mm -hmm. So we did. 
and here we are. And the rest yeah. is history. And you've here been with us pretty much since day dot, haven't you? Yeah. Uh, Chanda. Yeah. And your kits, I know, are superbly popular. In fact, I know just how many sales have been going through, how many orders have been placed um, bef long before we got to the show. So mm. people like to shop ahead. And everything we're seeing today is brand new. Brand new. We're a completely new counter. We've got nothing that we've brought back today. Fantastic. We went a bit mad. We normally try and bring out three, sometimes four new things, but today we sort of we're having, the counter. We're having a new avalanche because yeah. it's winter and Christmas. Right, let's start at the beginning because there'll be lots of demos here as well, which is really, really good because I'm fascinated about the detailing of the work you can do with your paper embroidery. It's brilliant. So let's start with our sparkling winter paper embroidery kit. Um, Talk me through, Rob, if you'll be so kind to, what we have in this kit. We've got everything you need to make eight paper embroidery cards. Okay. And this one makes eight completely unique cards. Mm -hmm. Some of the other kits do sort of four designs and two of each. This is eight, eight unique designs. Okay. So you're making four square cards, yep. four rectangular cards, and in the kit you've got oh, the all important you patterns. Okay. You've got the decoupage to put in with them. Mm -hmm. You've got the toppers to stitch onto the card blanks to put them on, you've got little coloured uh, silvery stickers you can see there highlighting the finish. They are stunning as well. You've got the threads, you've got the needle and pin, you've even got the envelopes to put them in. So what we've done is we've put everything in the kit you need mm -hmm. except a pair of scissors and a little bit of double sided tape. And that's all you need and to add to this as well. Yeah. Um, and I guess this is, is something as well, this is um, a, as a kind of medium, this is something you can pick up and you can put down and you can come back to... Yes. Yeah, you can. It's, it's one of those that, it's not a really, really quick and instant card, No. but the journey is as much about enjoying the, the journey of getting there as the end result. It's and really satisfying to do. And when you see, and, and even that the, the camera can't really tell you completely just how intricate and beautiful all of that detailing is in the embroidery itself, you have to see it with your own two eyes, really, Rob, don't you? You do. But it's one of those crafts that looks really hard to do. But as you'll find out in a bit, it's one basic technique. Once you've got that, the whole thing flows from there. I can't, I can't wait to see uh, the demos as well on this. Um, so let me show you some of the other designs as well. Let me just so that we've seen all of them. And they're gorgeous, really atmospheric scenes as well, aren't they? I think Absolutely they just beautiful. fit the time of year well. It's, it's the idea of, of winter and Christmas rather than the reality of what we sometimes get. <laughs> yeah. I love the little seal and the igloo there. That's fantastic, isn't it? So they're all eight individual um, cards on this one, plus pretty much everything you need to go with as well. 834051 is the item number as well. We'll do a little demo with those um, in a wee while as well. 1899. But remember, you're going to get a festive freedom price as well because we are really in the spirit. Today as well uh, is the last day for festive freedom. So £16.14 